What is going on, y'all, and welcome back to the stream, welcome back to the channel. Couldn't decide right there in my head whether I was gonna say welcome back to the stream or the channel, so I almost said both, and then I backed it up in my head, but you know what? That happens sometimes. Welcome back to the stream, y'all. I'm seeing a bunch of you guys out there jumping into the early squad. Y'all are all out there saying hi, and I cannot wait to say hi to each and every one of y'all. By the way, I have a massive amount of coffee fuel today, so I am freaking pumped and ready to go. Now, as you can see by the title, I'm sure the thumbnail now, we have all sorts of craziness to share with you guys in the stream today, but I'm also booting up my other screen right now so that I can start saying hi to you guys and also, of course, communicate with you guys while I am uh, playing the game, of course. So we got, let's see, Brayden and Gabe, Reptide Gamer. We got, let's see, uh, RSN Customs. We got Zach, Steven, Blake, uh, Team Googly Eyes and RC Gaming. We got Landon and DJ and Oliver and Gabriel, Tommy, and let's see, who else? Deadshot116, Gouvernos Plays 2, BMX Mason, and let's see, Tazda, what's going on, buddy? We got Todd. We got, let's see, Logi Gaming. We got Brandon and Maddox and Be Right Back. We got Herbie posting at the important links out there in the chat. If you need to check out any of those important links, make sure that you check the now pinned message at the top of the chat. We got Minnick as well out there in the chat. We got Caleb and Blake and Hossinator checking in as well. We got RS1 Rides. We got Peyton. We got Diesel Addict. What's going on, buddy? And we've also got Limes out there in the moderator and mod creator squad. We've also got Call of Duty Warzone out there in the chat. We got, let's see, uh, Snap Tripod. We got Keith. We got, let's see, Ultimate RC Studios. We got Gunner Love and we got Mr. Salmon25. We got Cody and Brenton and Caleb. And I'm trying to say hi to as many of you guys as I possibly can. We got, let's see, um, Randy Price. We got Bo12B. We got, let's see, once again, Herbie, Ra Herbie Racer in that moderator squad. We got Bear Bro. We got, let's see, uh, Bobo12B. And we've also got Cody Looney out there in the chat. And we got Booster94. We got Nitro Gaming and the Kid Lane and Randy and Lucas and Todd. I'm trying to say hi to as many of you guys as I possibly can. But without any further ado, let's go ahead and jump into some of the absolutely wild rigs and vehicles that we are going to be messing around with today. We got Banana 101 out there in the moderator squad. Welcome back, buddy. And Kyle Farrington, first time watching a live stream. First of all, thank you so much for jumping in and joining us for this one today. And also, if you are just now popping into the stream, thank you so much for being out here today and for taking the time to chill out with us. Now, with that being said, it's time to show y'all what we are going to be working with today. And it's also time to bring Diesel Addict into a VC. And we may be popping in and out of a couple of different VCs today. But um, Diesel just ping when ready and we should be good to go. Now, I'm going to go in and make sure that you guys have proper game audio. And uh, yeah, just Diesel, uh, drop a ping out there in the chat when you guys are ready. Now, some of the mods we're going to be talking about today are upcoming uh, console-friendly mods. Other ones are going to be PC mods, and we're going to have a big mix of pre pretty much everything across the board today. It's going to be a absolutely wild time. Now, one of the ones that uh, I cannot wait to share with you guys is this. Now, I am um, I am very excited to share this with y'all. It's one of the he pinged. Oh, God, did he now? Did he? Uh, let's see. Well, I guess we'll find out, won't we? <laughs> we'll find out if he pinged or not. Hey, what's up, buddy? How's it going today? Pretty freaking good. So I'm actually popping into the Proving Grounds real quick to show uh, the stream what we are going to be working with. And that is, or at least one of the rigs we're going to be working with, is the Monster Bus. Now the Monster Bus is a console-friendly project by Limes. And it is, it is, it's, it's something that it looks like it came right out of like... If, let's say, you know, the brain of Limes and the brain of Diesel Addict almost like, you know, kind of got together for, a, for like a dream, this is what they would have dreamed up. Now, let me, uh, let me spawn it in right here for y'all. As you can see, it's, um, it's a bit mega. Um, it's also capable of hauling cargo. You can literally, well, um, careful with that. But, uh, it doesn't always, it's not entirely done yet, so ignore the, um, <laughs> ignore the floating cargo, work in progress things. It'll obviously work a lot more consistently when it's done, but, uh, it's one of those things where you're gonna want to watch out for this thing once it actually is finished and once it's ready to drop on consoles. Now, let me show you guys one of the things that it can do. So if I go ahead and put the the big boy gearbox in it and the tuned engine and then some massive monster truck tires and a no damage suspension, watch this. I can literally make it climb the testing grounds garage. It's going to be a um it's going to be a little bit of an interesting time. So, we're just going to point it at the garage and we're going to ease onto the throttle. And then a little bit more 
Well, if we if we can actually get it to go a little further, come on. Come on. You know, I was really looking... Ah, there it is. I was going to say, I was really looking forward to that being a thing, and then for a minute it wasn't, and then it was again, and I was like, okay, yeah, please. Just a little bit more... A little bit more juice. Come on, and there we go. Now, considering the fact that Diesel Addict really enjoys parking on top of buildings, this is probably <laughs> going to be a very popular option for him. So let me actually go ahead and make sure that you guys have... Uh, adequate game volume as well as adequate uh, Discord VC volume. And I just want to make sure that you guys out there in the chat have adequate volume on both ends. So if you guys could let me know uh, whether or not you guys have a um, a really good, like, uh, really good volume level. Please let me know out there in the chat. Also, there's over 200 of you guys out here in the stream already. Thank you guys so much for stopping by. And if you're just joining us, massive thanks to each and every one of you. Also, we got, let's see, apparently we got more modders out there in the chat. We got a Dubs. We got Oscar checking in. What's good? We got Michaels. We got Marley Gaming. We got Spitball Plays. We got Nicholas Kazuki SU. What is going on, my dude? We got the boys GG. Thank you guys so much for stopping by. And let's see. Um, oh, he says, uh, he says, we good. We good. Uh, good volume. Uh, maybe even a little high. Oh, that's not normal. <laughs> that's mm. that's not normal Oops. at all, is it? Um, let's see. Well, I can actually I can actually bring that down just a tad bit. Just trying to find the perfect balance for y'all. And oh, it looks like it may have uh, it may have tried to auto balance it again. Oh my god! All right, stop auto balancing. Thank you. I would really appreciate <laughs> it if you would stop auto balancing. All right. So, what do you say we get ourselves into a multiplayer session, Diesel? I think we're going to begin on um, on Stadium today, considering what we have at our disposal. Okay, that sounds perfect. Also, <laughs> Dub said he's pushing an update to Grizzly and Juggernaut shortly. So. Oh, good. All right. Well, I mean, good for uh, good for everybody that's um that's excited to see those although um hopefully that that translates over to the updating system in game <laughs> actually working yeah. um oh the mega bus also just moved to the very front of my updated mod list so i'm hoping that doesn't create any weird scenarios but stadium super truck time is about to start up here and it's gonna be a wonderful place for us to take these things to mess around with them we also have a bunch of other new vehicles that you guys may not have seen yet but let's see wait whoa whoa whoa, whoa. limes was saying out there in the chat that let's see drive in that pond with the other tires they float they what whoa <laughs> Okay, all right. Well, we're gonna have to take it to um, take it to a map with a lot of water a little bit later. But let's see, Grizzly 3500. Yep, the second gen. Um, so we're actually gonna be driving Lime's second gen and Dub's second gen in this stream. And Dub's second gen is going to be console friendly as well. So for you console guys that want a second gen, uh, you're definitely gonna enjoy Dub's. And um, for the PC guys, you have the option of both. So let me go ahead and sell everything in here real quick, and then we will get Diesel into a multiplayer lobby. And then after that, we can kind of make our way into using the bus as well as a couple of other vehicles for a very interesting set of challenges, if I do say so myself. Now, we got, let's see, um, oh, yeah, sh uh, shooting for a Friday release date on the Grizzly. Oh, heck yeah, that's awesome, dude. And let's see, Herbie Racer says with a $5 super chat, first of all, thank you so much. Uh, let's kick this off. Uh, also, I have my, let's see, appointment tomorrow to find out what's going on. Well, I hope everything goes well, Herbie. And thank you once again for that $5 super chat. I genuinely hope everything goes well. He says, uh, Lime says, Monster tires float, T1s don't. Um, well, the biggest do, but yeah, LOL. Okay, cool. Uh, let's see. Little Mama, I see you out there in the chat. We got um, Creeper checking in. We got uh, TTV checking in out there in the chat as well. And let's see. Um, what is the Monster Bus based on? I mean, it's it's based, on a, <laughs> it's based on a bus. Uh it's like the bus is made out of bus. I mean, that's about all I can uh that's about all I can say on that. That's about as deep as I can get into the basis of that vehicle. So let's see. Don't forget about the big moose second gen. Uh well yeah, that one was released a while back, but I'm talking about like new second gens. That one's still a great truck, by the way. Don't get me wrong. Uh, that one's an awesome truck for those of you that want a second gen on consoles. That's a great option. But in terms of the new uh or newest second gens, um it's uh it's, it's a little bit older than the other two, although it'd be really interesting to kind Kind of have a little bit of a um a little bit of a showdown between like you know say for example the grizzly second gen and um the older second gen now let's see glitch gamer what's going on buddy i see you saying hi out there in the chat now let's see uh lime says well it's it's obviously based on lime's megabus what else would it be based on <laughs> uh, oh lime's man megabus? huh 
Lime's mini bus? Yeah, exactly, exactly. 662 <laughs> Mud Monkeys, what are the new console mods? Well, we're actually playing around with some uh, console-friendly mods that are not out just yet, but they will be coming out in the next few days. And then as far as the console-friendly Sega Gen goes, that one's going to be coming, uh, hopefully, Friday to PC, and then it'll probably be approved, hopefully, by the beginning of next week. Although the console mods have been a little bit, like, uh, slow to get approved this week because I think they had a lot of updates. Now, y'all are actually creeping up on the first 100 likes mark on the stream. Thank y'all so much. About to blow through the first 350 people out here as well. Thank you guys massively. Massively. So let's see. Exactly, Cleet. Exactly. What's going on, George? What's going on, Nolan? Thank you so much for stopping by. All right, Diesel. We are in a multiplayer lobby right now, and I'm about to buy myself the Mega Bus. So if you are, oh my God, it barely fits in the garage. Barely. Barely. Like, so you want, you want to know a uh, Hammond moment for the day so far? A Hammond moment? Yeah, I forgot to download the GWC Executioner. Oh, Oops. do you want me to turn it off? Because I can turn it off. Uh, if we're going to be doing any hauling, I should probably have it. Well, we're not just yet, if that makes sense. Um, uh, my bus is... Ah! <laughs> Bro, what the heck is my bus doing? Ah! <laughs> oh, now it's fine. Now it's fine. Oh, it was, um... It was having its way with it before. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that was, uh, that was something. That was something for sure. Oh my god. I'll tell you what, I'll turn off, um, Glitch's new, uh, Peterbilt. You have the old one, right? The, um, the freaking, uh, the cab over. Oh, uh, the cab over? Yeah. Yeah, I have that one. Beautiful. Okay, so let me actually go back to the main menu real quick. I'll turn the new one off, and then if you, uh, for whatever reason, get it downloaded a little bit later, we can, like, turn it back on, but it's not really gonna be a big deal. Alright, so I'm gonna load right back into co-op. Stadium Super Truck, let's go, and you should be able to pop right in. Now, let's see. I think it's based off of a Ford School Bus TC. I mean, it's based, like, loosely on something like that, like, uh, loosely on kind of, like, a Ford chassis, but at the end of the day, I mean, it's, it's Lime's own creation, and that's kind of how it's going to stay, if that makes sense, but it's also fully, fully Fully, fully console friendly. What's going on, WRX Evolve? I see you out there in the chat checking in. And let's see, put the monstrosity against the bus. Way ahead of you on that one. It's freaking happening. Yep. <laughs> it's absolutely freaking happening. You guys, you guys better know it. Let's see. You think that bus is crazy? You should look at some of the things in my ideas folder. Well, you know, I I I wonder sometimes about the um wait, let's see. Creep of Death Customs, uh, I think Lime should make a uh, Cummins Diesel. Uh, well, he actually, he has a, a, a second gen that is a donator access work in progress right now, and we're definitely going to be bringing that out for sure, like the title says. Nicholas, thank you so much for that $10 super chat. Diesel Brothers made a mega bus on the Discovery Channel. That is true, although this one's a little bit different than that. But once again, thank you for supporting the channel and supporting the stream with that $10 super chat. All right, boys, and let's see. Uh, Shaniza now says, I think Diesel is too quiet. Oh, God. Oh, oh, God. I mean, I did pull the mic away a little bit. <laughs> okay, I was gonna say, he's probably not that quiet. Alright, so I'm gonna hop back into the Mega Bus. I, we're back in multiplayer now, and I'm going oh, to just... connection failed. Uh, maybe try again? Yep, yeah, trying again immediately. We'll see what we get. Yep. I'm taking the Monster Bus for a little bit of a rip, and let's see if we can... It's an 88 Ford School Bus with a massive motor. Also, check the interior and the motor in the back. Yeah, the interior is wild. Look at this interior. It's an actual, like, modeled school bus interior. It's insane. Although it does have a... It looks like it's got a manual, like, H-pattern gearbox. And then all of your, like, rows of seating. And then a gigantic, like, supercharger on top of a V8 in the back. Let's see. Carter Vogue 64 with the $1 Super Chat. Thank you so much, buddy. And it looks there like we go. Diesel Addict made it in. First of all, also, thank you guys so much for over 400 of you out there on the stream right now. If you're just joining us today, welcome. It is certainly going to be a amazing time. Whether you, like... Like crazy over the top vehicles like this one or realistic vehicles like some of the other ones we're going to be driving on the stream uh today is going to be like we're going to be chilling out we're going to be having fun with trucks talking to you guys talking to diesel like interacting with some of the mod creators it's going to be a really good time so let's fire this thing back up also speaking of insane mods in their folder all i'm going to say is that limes has a picture of the real world version of something in my models folder Oh, God. <laughs> Should I be worried or concerned? <laughs> uh, yes. <laughs> oh, oh, dear. So, uh, you know those TUZ Warthogs that are outside the garage? Yeah, uh, RIP. Oh! Apparently, they, they, oh, they turtled me. Okay, um, that was not what I expected. Let's do a quick drive with the, um, 
Let's see. CNC overtime shocks, no damage. Let's do a quick drive with the big T1s. Because the big T1s are also, like, really different. You know what I mean? It's, like, it's a totally different vibe. Like, this is a ginormous, like, mega truck school bus vibe. Whereas the other one is, like, a monster truck school bus vibe. They're huge regardless. But Dude. Oh. I'm uh, hi. Hi. Hello. I did not realize that this on the T1s, not even the monster tires, this on the T1s is bigger than the monstrosity. Hmm. That is ridiculous. And you're on, I believe, like the biggest uh, suspension and tire package, right? Yep. Th this is as big as monstrosity can get. Okay, so keep this in mind. I am on the mid-range suspension and I'm the same height as you. <laughs> <laughs> Actually, you're taller. I'm looking at it from perfectly, from the perfect passenger side view of Monstrosity. You're taller than I am. Good grief. What is going on? Let's see, Ulysses and Chance, and let's see, Captain VR, we got Mercedes Ritz. Is this model PS4? Uh, it will be. It's not just yet, but it will be. Trust me on that one. Uh, it does not want to climb this building. It says no. It says absolutely not. It says I don't like the sound of that. Uh, what about if I... What about if I was to try to, like, walk up over the other, um... <laughs> wow, I thought it was smaller. Hmm. Yeah, apparently we myth-busted that one. Let's see. I'll be home in a few, and then we can trail uh, a little bit later on in the stream for sure, Frog. Yeah, just hang around. Oh, boy. Let me see if I could use these, uh... These warthogs as a booster to get up onto this building. Oh, yeah. Easy. Bro. Bro. <laughs> <laughs> now here's yeah, my question can you knock mine off of the building uh we shall test that now Gubernuts plays 2 had a really good question he goes can the bus tow a trailer yes now the way that it does it is <laughs> is like it's so silly but you're gonna be like you're gonna be like what gooseneck <laughs> hitch well gooseneck hitch and mega hitch so, if we leave the garage now with the mega hitch, and uh, coming soon, hi. Oh. Yeah, definitely coming soon. Try the smaller tires. That's a lot to spin, you know? Yeah, that's fair. That's very fair. So, if I go and put some of the smaller... Did you oh. just flip it? You just flipped it. Nope, you? I did not. Ah, yeah, you Ninja did. Went. Ninja went just in time. All right. Look at this gooseneck hitch. The gooseneck hitch sits on the most massive drop hitch in the world. And am I... Wait, is this the trailer store? Yeah, that's the trailer store. Wait, well, it didn't... Hold on, it didn't pop up for me. Maybe I didn't drive far enough into it. Okay, there it is, for whatever reason. Okay, so... No, short answer is the bus broke it. <laughs> you what? Oh. The bus broke it. That's why it didn't show um, up. Actually, no. So, <laughs> it's functional! <laughs> It's actually functional. I have the world's largest drop hitch, and I can tow trailers. <laughs> it's just a big meme. That all this is is a gigantic <laughs> meme. Also, thank you guys so much for over 500 of y'all out there on the stream right now. Y'all are about to blow through that first 200 likes mark on the stream. First of all, let me know in the chat. Check in in the chat if this is something that you guys will use when it comes to console because it is coming to console. This is genuinely a console friendly mod and it will be making its way there as soon as it's finished. I, I just, I just want to blow through objectives with Diesel in campaign mode with two school buses. Like two freaking school buses. Bro. Todd Burt says, great for campaign, totally balanced. Exactly, exactly. We could, yeah. blow dude, yeah. can you imagine blowing through Maine with like two school buses that each have like one of Red's uh, six unit goosenecks behind them? I kind of can, actually. I kind of want about to. Like, legit, you just, did you have to pounce on those trees? Like, was that entirely necessary? I mean, technically it was your trailer that flipped me, but I digress. Let's see, cage and crane on the crane toe suspension. Oh, that's fair. Yeah. Okay. So let me um let me actually go sell this trailer real quick so I can show you guys how insanely like objective powerful this thing is. So it's not just the fact that it has the goosenecks, right? It can do something. I'm just gonna detach it rather than sell it. It can do something even crazier than that. So it can actually go into the so let's see mega rack. And 
Why is this locked? Oh, reach rank six? Okay, well, let me, let me go, like, do the little rank task real quick. And then I'll show you guys what this thing looks like with the crane on the top. The perfect vehicle for go. Mandra. Oh, yeah, pretty much exactly. Thank you for the max rank. Okay. You're welcome. See you, Z Warthog. And now... He's having a bad day. Now, as you can see, nothing will ever be a... Nothing will ever be a problem for this thing again. Like, cargo? Oh, yeah, done. Like, need to reload? Oh, yeah, done. Five slots on the roof, plus the trailer, plus the heavy crane. So, I had a little bit of a weird um, issue with cargo falling through the... Um, like the roof rack a little bit ago, but I'm I'm sure that's something that'll get ironed out in the future. But two school buses on a Mandra sounds amazing, bro. I know, right? Two school buses on a Mandra sounds like uh, Doom to Imandra in no time flat is what that sounds like. Yeah, pretty much. Bear Bro Tuska says, "School, really? Please, uh, please let this be a normal field trip, but with Tomcat. <laughs> yeah, pretty much." See, what we're going to be doing is we're going to be taking the campaign maps to school on this one. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, that's beautiful. That's absolutely... Wait. Yeah, it's a manual load roof right now. Oh, okay. So, if you load it manually, it's fine. So, that makes sense. So, you don't have to go uh, too crazy. Hi. Hello. <laughs> I'm, I'm stuck. trapped by your front axle. There we go. I mean... Technically, I... that was the tires. The front oh, was it your axle? Oh, yep. oh, that's fair. What's up, Jackson Riggs? And let's see, we got Ashley Brown and Blake and Ball Shorts all out there in the chat checking in and saying hi. Thank you so much. The bus looks, um, wait, takes the power of monstrosity and triples it? Yeah, it, it, it kind of does, honestly. All right, let's go ahead and see uh, if we make an attempt at this jump real quick. Wow, that acts like it does it in slow motion. And I'm not even on, like, the freaking top-notch suspension at all. That is so incredible. Is that bus console friendly? You're dang right it is. It's not out yet, but it's definitely going to be. Um, once Limes is done uh, prepping it, he's going to release this thing as a fully console friendly mod. And I cannot wait for you guys to all get your hands on it. Is that a drop hitch? Uh, only the world's largest drop hitch that you could ever possibly find. Yup, 110%. That is a drop hitch, bro. Absolutely. Wait, let's see. Wait, it's the size because that's how it looks at 300 FPS? Oh, God. And here comes... It looks like Diesel failed the jump, and I don't know how he did yeah. that. How? Uh, look behind... Uh, look behind what's... Look behind what's... Wow, look what's behind Monstrosity, and you'll see why. Oh, is that the trailer that I left out there? Maybe. <laughs> uh, may maybe. Maybe, maybe, maybe. <laughs> oh, my God, that's freaking brilliant. Well, what do you say... We take some school buses and absolutely ruin some game balance. <laughs> yeah, that sounds good. Uh, my truck is stuck. Hi. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> um. Yeah, that physics happened. So here's a great challenge. I am going to set our main save for early in the morning, like 6 o'clock in the morning. And we're going to see how much we can get done before it like before the sun starts to go down that sounds like it's going to be an absolutely incredible time what do you guys think yeah that sounds good <laughs> what do you mean it's totally balanced yeah exactly yeah pretty yeah, well kind of jason our our trucks at least let's see i love snorter dude me too slash raptor says yes <laughs> it's uh it's one of those um can you imagine seeing that bus in like a doug demuro moment when he looks at the camera and he goes this <laughs> and i'm like is what and he goes this is right as a matter of fact he would pretty much probably be like this is incredibly stupid but it's also incredibly wonderful let me explain why oh yeah <laughs> um let's see with that bus lots will get done or nothing will get done i i think you're uh i think you're right so let me go ahead and uh, set this i would to... argue for both lots of nothing Lots of nothing, yeah. All right, so we got a 6 <laughs> o'clock in the morning, retaining the Tundra, 
and then retaining the second gen, and I'm gonna spawn in my ANK civilian and retain that again, just for stability reasons, and then we're gonna load into main, and then we're gonna buy some buses, and, uh, let's see, BNP Productions, can you play on Cajon Pass? Uh, I don't know, maybe a little bit later on. I don't know if, uh, if, uh, we both have it or not. Let's see, can you show us the new console mods? Well, the console mods we're talking about today are actually not out just yet, but the, um... The one we're going to be talking about right now is the Mega Bus, and it's actually going to be coming out very, very soon. Um, as soon as Limes is done prepping it, there's also a Dubs Console Second Gen, which is on its way soon as well. Most likely Friday, uh, it's going to be sent for testing, and then the following week, we'll hopefully get it on consoles. But um, as far as some of the other mods that we're going to be checking out today, we got some PC mods on the list as well. So make sure you stay tuned for anything and everything that we are going to be covering today. Let's see. Every time I look at uh, look at that, I just hear Clarkson saying yes. <laughs> well, this is the biggest bus dot 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 in the world. I have a I have probably <laughs> I probably do a terrible impression of that, but let's see. Ethan Ricketts says uh unbalanced doesn't exist for diesel. And with that, you'd be right. And it's like, oh no, 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 no. You want to actually know a little bit of a Oh, thank you, Ink. I really appreciate that. You want to know a modified, uh, modified version of a top gear quote that fits perfectly in this scenario? <laughs> if that pulled up outside your house, you'd think, oh no, a diesel addict is here. <laughs> <laughs> Pretty much. <laughs> uh, Although to be fair, I wouldn't necessarily go pull it up outside the house i'd probably just go right through it <laughs> well no no if that pulled up on top of your house <laughs> oh god Pretty much, yeah i'm gonna go with the 169 inch monster tires the long toe strap the mega rack the heavy crane the mega hitch the gooseneck hitch the yellow custom monster bus wheels and uh yeah what a beautiful morning 6 30 in the morning let's get this thing prepped and ready Oh my god. I love how the lights on the crane also kind of help. Alright. The sun just came up out here, dude. The, uh, the bus is reporting for duty. There's also a turtled TUZ420 out here. <laughs> uh, I have no idea how that happened. I'm, I'm sure you don't. I also, I also feel as though you are lying, but that's okay. <laughs> oh, me? Hey, yes, you. <laughs> <laughs> Let's see if we can... Oh, God! Yo, this crane cannot pull that TUZ Warthog off the ground. It's pulling me into the ground. What the heck? That is a normal TUZ Warthog. That is not... Or not TUZ Warthog. Uh, TUZ 420. That's that's a normal one. That's nothing over the top and crazy. What the heck is going on with that? That's so weird. Oh, Bentley and Johnny and Pamela. What's going on out there in the chat? The anchor is very effective. Let's see, 6.30 in the morning, let's go tear up the neighborhood and scare everybody. Yeah, pretty much. Pretty much, yeah. Oh, no, wait, no. This is the bus that you have to take if your homework doesn't get turned in on time. That That's that's how it works. <laughs> yep, exactly. See, the thing is, if this was the bus that I had to take if my homework didn't get turned on, on uh, turned in on time, I, I'd, I would purposely make my homework late every day. <laughs> <laughs> Can I actually leave the... Oh, my God. I'm stuck. Hold on. I have a feeling that the T1s are going to be a lot more practical because I have also a feeling that the monster tires are going to make me stuck everywhere. So, you went with the biggest T1s, didn't you? I went with the biggest things I could get my hands on. Yeah, that would be the 236-inch T1s, which are, fun fact, taller than the monster tires. Thomas and Johnny, what's going on, my dude? And TC, do you have a Discord? Absolutely, bro. Make sure you join our Discord. It is The link to it is pinned at the top of the chat. So if you guys are curious as to what the latest console mods are, as well as want to check in on our Discord, once again, uh, check out the pinned message at the top of the chat that includes all of the necessary links. Now, Diesel is already heading off into the wilderness, and uh, he's already got himself a trailer. Do I don't even think we have anything active right now. Uh, let's go ahead and... I don't think and we do. Let's see. Oh, we can unlock a gateway with this. Metal beams times four, oh, cool. concrete slabs times two. Access to gateway. Let's freaking go. All right, so we're on a little bit of a time. Uh, let's see. Oh, thank you so much, Ethan. I really appreciate that. Just a better uh, better size is one down from max. Oh, okay. So Lime says if you want the best performance out of the bus, the best tires to use are the one size down from maximum on the T1s, the 193-inch. Mm. 
Yeah. Well, if that's what if that's also, what Lime says, then I'm going for it. And Jason, I'm yeah, doing really point. well. I actually just ordered um I ordered some upgraded tie rods for the Tundra because I wanted to make sure I didn't break my stock ones off road. The new ones that I have coming in are coach uh, coach builder off road tie rods, and they are basically way beefier the joints are stronger and they actually give you more steering angle than stock as well also what happened to diesel also hp penguins what's going on buddy i see out there in the chat what did also you do? quick question for limes what's the uh what's the best engine in trans combo uh he says uh big boy transmission with um max engine i think is what he just said okay i'm pretty sure that's what i have now let's see yeah, our I had first to step mine. yeah is th this is this is much more much more zoom on this one yeah our first step is metal beams times four and i'm gonna go ahead and handle all of well i don't think i can get all of those in one run because they take up two a piece i got a six unit so i can get four out of six and then you'll have to get the other one okay okay yeah tuned and big boy is what i have why are you cartwheeling back there uh reasons i mean also, i guess the horn. huh hit the horn Oh, it's a freaking foghorn! <laughs> oh, that's amazing. Jeffrey and Sonia, what's going on out there in the chat? Carter Golf says, uh, did I miss anything? Uh, you ain't missing it if you're seeing it right now, buddy. We got Dylan and Pamela and Willie Pat out there in the chat as well. We got, uh, let's see, I think another Dylan as well. And let's see, what year is your Tundra? Just out of curiosity. It is a 2015, bro. Yep, 2015 with a ready lift six inch kit with the, um, let's see, the coilover upgrade, the, uh, the external reservoir coilover upgrade. And it's also got BDS uh, traction bars, although I may be taking those off when I go to uh, get rock sliders because I don't think the traction bars will interface with the rock sliders the way I want to. And I'm also kind of concerned that the traction bars are going to get, like, caught on things off-road. Plus, my truck doesn't make enough power right now to really need the traction bars. All right, let's, uh, let's grab some framing right here. The biggest thing I'm worried about is flipping my cargo over. Is that bad? I mean, you have a crane, so you should be fine. Yeah. All right, I can take one more unit of these, and then you're going to have to get the next one. This bus makes monstrosity look okay. tiny. I know, dude. It's that wild. It's genuinely that freaking wild. Oh, I see metal framing over there. Yeah, that's where I'm headed. So there's two left over there. I'm going to get one, and then you can get the other one, okay? okay I was going to get the concrete slabs over here, actually. Oh, that's fair. Then I can go. I can go back and get uh, the rest from here. Crazy Chaos says, "Bring the yeet." Oh, you better believe we're bringing the freaking yeet today, Joshua. What's going on? And is there any news on Xbox Crossplay yet? Um, they said it would be kind of within the next uh, next uh, few weeks ish after the last update. So I feel like they'll they'll probably say something more about it pretty soon. Uh, Cat Marauder says, "What is that?" Uh, that is Lime's upcoming console-friendly monster bus with the ability to haul stuff and lift stuff in the campaign. It is so incredibly nuts. Like, you cannot make this crap up. I mean, this is... This is... You want to talk about the most next-level thing I've seen in a long time? This is it right here. It makes the monstrosity look like a freaking toy. It absolutely does. It absolutely does. Okay, so where are we delivering this stuff? Now, it is getting delivered to... Uh, wait, access to civilization. Um, do I have to actually go to the other... Oh, wait a minute. Is the drop-off so... point... So... Huh? Oh, northeast ton... Oh! It's all the way in the... Oh, God. It's all the way in the corner. Okay! Oh, you want to see something glitchy? Sure. Also, somebody said manual load the beams on the roof, and you're right. And let's see. Hello, I honestly forgot about today's stream. Well, hey, uh, you didn't forget for long because you are here now. Thank you so much, buddy. Appreciate it. Let's see. I okay, I'm home and sitting in... Uh... Slabs. Wait, what? I have both concrete slabs I just tipped. Oh, no. Let's and they're see. floating in space. Why are they floating in space? Because I, I auto-loaded them instead of manual load. Oh, yeah, um, I'm gonna, let's see, I'm gonna spawn these uh, in manual go? load, and then I'm gonna use my crane. Frog also says he's sitting in game VC right now, but, um, I, <laughs> I don't know if we're ready for that just yet, Frog. Um, we're definitely gonna be mess around, messing around with this for a little while longer before we trail, but, um, but stick around and, um, and drop back in a little while, and then we'll get a, uh, a trailing setup, uh, put together. 
Let me I think get I might have lost the concrete beam. Concrete, the concrete beams are not a thing, bud. No. Well, the concrete, those things, slabs, that's it. <laughs> yeah, there you go. Let's see, uh, did Limes do the buzz? Indeed he did, indeed he did, bro. Let's see, you see me floating? Yeah, pretty much. Yep, frog, I got out of hand. Wait, yeah, no, that's fine, just letting you know. Hey, yeah, it's no worries, man. No worries. So, yeah, they, I think they're under the map somewhere because the bus tipped and I don't see them anymore. Oh, okay. Well, we might have to find a secondary source for them. <laughs> yeah. Impossible to pack cargo. Uh-oh. Yeah, something broke, I think, because I can't see them now at all. Let me see if it's possible to pack them now. Impossible to pack cargo. Limes, what did you do? What did you do? Um, or what did I do wrong that it doesn't like? Is probably the better way of saying it, because... I'm really, like, unsure here of what I did wrong. Uh... Because it doesn't really make any sense to me. Like, why would it be unhappy with me? Oh, God. No, 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 no. Why would it be unhappy with me right now? I'm sure there's some kind of, like, perfect, like, sweet spot, but I very obviously don't know what that is right now. Um, impossible to pack. Let's see. IDK, it's broke, LOL, put the crane on it. Yeah, okay. <laughs> that seems to be the, um, that seems to be the move. All right, let me let me wedge this thing then. Do the good old. This thing is just nuts. Yeah, I'm gonna do the good old crane wedge. It's a classic uh, diesel so attic glad. move. A funny thing you mentioned that I actually did that just yesterday when recording in Alaska. Oh God, I'm sure you did. I, that's the thing is like. I, I know not to doubt you on that. So I am now headed back to, uh, well, not headed back to, but just headed to the general direction of, um, oh no. Why is the stuff on the trailer not? Oh God. Uh, I don't care that that's impossible to, Ugh! okay. I have, I have managed to get a fuel trailer stuck in my bus's wheel. Oh dear God. Um, all right, I'm packing the cargo on the trailer. Now I'm hooking back up to the beams that I just literally threw on the ground. And let's see, have you put the monstrosity next to this yet? I think it's bigger. It is. Yeah, we did that earlier. It is. <laughs> this makes the monstrosity look small. Cashborn, this is a upcoming console mod right here. So if you are curious about what the latest console mods are, um, you can check the pinned link at the top of the chat. And this that you're seeing, the monster buzz, is actually a act, like a genuine upcoming console mod. So it's not done yet, obviously, but it will be on consoles as soon as it gets approved, and of course, as soon as uh, Limes is finished developing it. All right, let me get you. So yeah, I put down a little bit. I put a screenshot of my predicament in Discord, by the way, if anybody wants to see it. Oh God, I I'm sure it's a predicament and a half if you put it in the Discord. Yeah, somehow, some reason, the winch keeps going from the back of the trailer to the most random solid object. Okay. That's a bit odd. And, and I am not kidding. I am watching this fully loaded fuel trailer uh -huh. dance around inside inside my tire. Bruh, uh, oh my god. Exploded. What, something just exploded again? Yeah. I think I might be in a lot of trouble. I don't know if you want to come over to where I am on the map. I mean, I'm not <laughs> in trouble yet, but... <laughs> Do you want me to, um, like, let this thing be for the moment? Actually, let me go into photo mode. I, where are I you need to at? preserve this. Oh, you're I'm over... The, oh, God. Here. Oh, my jeez. I see you on the... Okay, I might have to actually see that. Hold on. Um... I let can't me just, get like, the camera far enough away from this thing. Let me just let that to, chill right to there for the a entire second. thing. Okay, L like, don't make any sudden moves. I'm about to head over there. Give me literally, like, just one second. I'm changing the color of the second gen, and I'm putting the fast gearbox, and, like, 
sort of a race-ish uh, suspension on it. Um, and taking the, the added bumper weight off. So I have, uh, so I'm full, like, speed. The speed! I need the, uh, actually, I need, I need high suspension mode before I take off. Try to drive across the harbor. Oh, bro, I definitely need to buy another bus to do that. That's gonna be amazing. Okay, can you stay there without moving, Diesel? Um, so far as I can tell, yeah. Okay, all right, I'm making a run for it. I'm trying to get out there as quickly as I humanly possibly can. Um, we'll see how well that, whoa, we'll see how well that goes. I've already nearly flipped, so don't worry about that. Don't worry about me. Um, I'll be fine. You so, may have yeah, to, that... uh, scrape pieces of my truck up off the ground later, but don't worry about that. It's all good. <laughs> yep. So, yeah, here here's a doozy going in Discord now for everybody who wants to see it. If you guys want to see Dis uh, Diesel's perspective of what's going on, like, firsthand, make sure you check out the pinned link to our Discord and join it. Um, The link is pinned at the top of the chat, all right, guys? Oh, boy. All right, for a little bit of a tip. Yeah. But, I mean, oh, no! in, if I can say, this, this is a predicament that... I don't think even I've been able to do this before. Yeah, I was gonna say, like, I know we came out here to, like, nail some objectives down in the shortest amount of time possible, but I think we may have wound up in a situation that neither one of us was fully prepared for. So I yep. am absolutely raging across that flooded area of the map in the second gen, and I'm gonna take the route that goes kind of around the bay, and I think that's probably my fastest way to you, right? Yeah, probably. Okay. Also, it's no longer standing on its nose, but it's uh, it's in a spot. As a long really as it's bad in, one. as long as it's in a spot that like I feel that nobody has ever seen before, I feel like we've got a very interesting scenario on our hands. Also, we need to try to drive out to where the ships are. That needs to become a thing. Yep. Let's see. TC, take the bus off the biggest jump you can find. Bro, it's happening. It is absolutely... Just you yep. wait. Make sure y'all stick around, because this is not the only thing we're doing with those buses. It is by far not the only thing we're doing with those buses. We're taking them to the... Oh, no. Oh, God. I'm already seeing... I'm seeing stuff that looks like it's very broken. Yeah, something uh... actually was starting to explode underground for a minute there. Oh, uh... <laughs> What? Yeah, I'm I'm stuck. <laughs> I, I should say so, sir. Um, <laughs> what? What's going on, Jerry? Hey, I see you saying out get... there in the chat. Paige Rogers, welcome back. See you checking in. Need more second gens for console? Oh, I get that because you get you. Oh, you're trying to. Um, you might want to let go of your trailer because you're inverted on top of your trailer. I know. <laughs> hey, absolutely, it is, Herbie. One hundred percent. DJ Dirt Bike 20, what is good, my dude? Uh, are you? Okay, come on. By the way, your um, your trailer leg, or not what your trailer leg, sorry, your um, your stabilizer, or one of your stabilizers for your crane is spinning like an airplane propeller, and I'm not even <laughs> making that up. It is spinning like an airplane propeller. <laughs> what? I think the trailer was probably a bad idea. Maybe, just, just, just maybe. Just maybe. I, I just... Ah! Is that console friendly? The Megabus is, and I cannot wait for you guys to get your hands on it because y'all are going to have the actual time of your lives. Okay, come on. That trailer is not coming out of there. Fun fact, it is bigger than the monstrosity, which is uh, insane to think about. What? Uh, I think I'm stuck again. I mean, you are stuck on a power pole, if that, if that helps. <laughs> what? You might want to let the power pole go. I'm trying to let the power pole go. Oh, there we go. It didn't want to let me. It, it didn't want to let you go. The power pole was yeah, clingy. for a second there. Let's see. What about the for second, second gen? There, um, I thought something else was going on. Yeah, exactly. This particular second gen is a PC one, but there is another second gen that is coming soon that is console friendly. So make sure you guys stay tuned for that one. Um, he's probably releasing it on about Friday. Now let's see. Me too, DC. Oh, absolutely, bro. Thomas Brown. I see you saying hi. Let's see. Turn the chat into a meme. Oh, that's that's pretty easy for that to happen. Let's say it's so much bigger than a normal truck. I know. All right. Um, would you like yeah, to see? Yeah, that trailer is. 
That trailer is stuck. It is not coming out of there. Would you like to see if you could oh, pick me right. up? I think I've tried that before, and the game does not like it. Here, let me put out my anchors. Well, hang on. Um, let me see if there's a truck nearby that I can... Oh, crap. Um, I was hoping there was a truck nearby that I could switch to, so you could pick me up, and then... Wait, let's see. Potty says, why aren't you in the mega bus? Let's see. Video idea. TC, wait, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Whoa, 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 wait a minute. TC, Monster Bus versus Monstrosity versus Monster Max 2 versus Monster Max versus any regular pickup truck. The thumbnail alone will be priceless. Indeed it would, Frog. By the way, uh, what's up, Landon and Lorson? I see you guys checking it out there in the chat and saying hi. By the way, y'all are actually creeping up on that 300 likes mark on the stream already. That's freaking amazing. Let's see. All right, over plays. We will see when we get back, buddy. And let's see. Have Diesel pick up the second gen when you aren't in it, or you are in it. Well, it won't work when I am in it because it's uh, it's too heavy with the way the game uh, physics work. But let's see. Is the newest uh, RNG truck coming to console? I'm sure it is. Yeah, I'm sure it is. Let's see. I think you're onto something. Where Frog? Uh, wait. Come there, Frog. Maybe has Diablo. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Stock CK1500 versus Megabus. You know how that's gonna go. All right. Um, what Actually, do you that's say? That's a good idea. I will legit buy a CK fifteen hundred and beat it up with this. Oh, I'm sure you will. Now, what do you say I get another mega bus real quick and we attempt to um to drive out to those ships? Yeah, that sounds good. I'm gonna recover to the garage and get rid of the crane. Okay, that's fair. Now, as far as the, cause I have my objective based mega bus and this one's just gonna be my for fun mega bus. Um, with the big boy no damage and the 228 monster tires, long toe strap, no rack, and a uh, yellow uh, custom wheel. All right, so this is about as, like, monster as it can get. And it's time for us to head out to the bay. It, can you believe it's already, like, afternoon in-game? Like, literally the whole in-game day has almost already gone by. I mean, considering I got stuck in a building i'm not surprised i mean i guess that's fair i mean now granted we could start like restart the day and night cycle but jeez let's see wait 56 um oh really 56 megabytes and nine ram usage wow wow that's insane especially for like a console friendly mod that's that's incredible let's see oh easy where is the Oh, you're already that far ahead of me? Jeez. That shows how much... I mean, um, I drive fast. Well, I mean, that just shows how much easier it is to get through obstacles with the freaking T1 tires than the monster tires, because, like, the T1s are narrower, and they fit through more stuff. But I'm just going to ignore the trees. You know, ignore... You know how we were talking about ignore ice? This is ignore trees right here. Yeah, I just, I just killed probably about three trees. I'm driving up them. Like, up them, over them, through them, like, all of the things... Those tires are ginormous. I, mean, I, did, I did hit them hard, too, so... Yeah, that's There's fair. That. Let's see. Justice says, bro, those tires are bigger than your ego. Well, to be fair, I wouldn't say that my ego is all that massive, but uh, either way, no matter what way you slice it, these tires are gigantic. All right. Venturing out to sea now. Got to push the suspension up. Oh, you didn't do that already? I did that already before I left. Nope. <laughs> Supposedly, these are the ones that float. I don't know how well they float, but supposedly they... Oh, my God. Um. Well, we're on to something here. <laughs> Whoa. Well, half of it floats. I don't know if the back floats as well, but... Oh, don't stall it. I tried to put it in high, and it was, like, starting to stall out. I mean, I was like, no, please don't do that. Please don't do that. Yeah, please don't do that. Low. Oh, wait. There we go. Might be getting somewhere. What happens? Nope. Doesn't like him when I put it in high. Yeah, I'm an automatic. It pr seems to prefer automatic, actually. It also only uh, likes me if I go straight. Like, I have to go perfectly straight. Otherwise, I, um... I, like, slowed oh, come way on. down. Um, you might have slowed down, but the front end of my bus came out of the water. I see that. Uh, what's, what's going on? I'm picking up speed. I, I don't know how, but I also know I'm about to get stuck on some boats, and I need help. Oh, jeez! I'm about to tip! I'm I mean, about you should to be tip. able... Oh,
I got one engine damage. Oh, no, you did, actually. Yeah, no, I did. I'm also... <laughs> I have a feeling I wasn't meant to be out here. <laughs> Is it just the game's buoyancy keeping the float? It might be. Hey, what's up, Glitchworks? Let's see you checking it out there in the chat. Thank you so much for stopping by. And let's see, stuck on a... Like a power line? Yeah, pretty much. Can I? Uh-oh. Yeah, I'm just... I think I'm starting to sink. I'm... I've already sunk. Um, I've sunk quite um, spectacularly, actually. Spectacular sinkage. Is the bus private? Uh, no, so everybody that's out there in the stream right now, this bus is a work in progress, but it's going to be both public and console friendly. So pretty soon, as um, soon as this bus is done, it will be on consoles as soon as it gets approved. Uh, did you hit an invisible um, wall? No, I'm still going forward on two wheels. You're actually... And the front end just came down. I just realized the ship is the edge of the map. So if you can make it to the ship, you can make it to the edge of the map. Um, I don't see the ship at all, actually. I see the little warning barricade, but that's it. Oh, that's strange, then. Okay, let's I'm see. I'm actually about to touch the barricade. So it's the tire size because the smaller tires don't do it. That's so weird. Let's see. If you go big enough, the game just makes it float. Good to know. Uh, apparently it does, Frog. Let's see. The bus is lighter than a boat. Than the boat. Wait, huh? Yeah, just about. I know, right? All right, I'm going to leave that one out there. I'm going to swap over to my other mega bus. I have hit the wall. I have hit the wall, he says. <laughs> Alright. I wonder if I can you reach your bus that? with my winch from here. If you can what? Nope, not... Oh. Reach, reach my your bus? bus with winch from here. Yeah, I, I doubt it. Yeah, I mean. I'm legitimately on the edge of the map. Jeez. I'm making a break for the other map with these uh, materials because I want to actually, like. I want to get at least one load of these things dropped off because I just want to be able to say that I've done at least one objective in a freaking mega bus. Again, yeah, with the world's like largest drop hitch. Now, I don't know if you want to actually still try to get that concrete, but like, I mean, I'm, I'm all in on these. And the funny thing is, these tires are so tall that even though this has otherworldly levels of power, when you put weight behind it and then ask it to go up a steep hill with tires this big, it struggles a little bit. And that's kind of realistic does, when you think about it. Considering the size of it, yeah. Like, I mean, if you really were actually doing this IRL, you would have to have, like, multiple thousands of horsepower and, and like, insane amounts of gear reduction to make this work. Also, am I going to lose that bit of cargo uh, when I fast travel to the other map with that cargo winch tied? I don't know. Let's see. Uh, a good question. Yeah, let's find out. Three, two, one. Yeah, yeet. Let's see. By the Wait. way, do you have little beams? I have all of them. Okay. Let's see. Holly says, is that on consoles? It will be as soon as it's done and as soon as the developers approve it. But yes, it is a public console-friendly mod project. Mm-hmm. I'm super excited for it. Now, let's see. Oh, thank you so much, DJ Dirtbike20. And what is going on, Slash Raptor and Breda Jones? Oh, oh, yeah, we're going to freaking send it. Let's see. If you check out the 362 Judge, um, actually, yes. So the 362 Judge, there will be a video coming out on that really, really shortly. Um, uh, Glitch, I actually really enjoyed driving that thing. And so I'm pretty sure you're going to enjoy the video on it. Absolutely. And let's see. Is it still? Yo, bro, my cargo is still there. The winched cargo, even. That's impressive. Uh, I broke something. <laughs> Again? Why is it that I've had, like, a very smooth experience with this thing, and you're just like, I've broken this, and then this, and then this? I mean... The thing is, I went and put the big 215-inch tires on it again because I figured out this thing goes like a shot. Well, I thought you were going to say because I can, and I wouldn't have blamed you. I wouldn't have blamed you one bit. I really wouldn't have blamed you. <laughs> Well, that's the other reason, is it's like, okay, can I put them on it? Yes, I can. Okay. Should I put them on it? No, probably not, but I'm going to anyway. Well, it's like, can I? Yes. Should I? No. Will I? Absolutely. <laughs> yes. All right, let's see. I think I'm going to just drive straight up the river. I've got no reason not to. I mean, oh, that's a, that's a late <laughs> hole. Pretty Hang much. on. I love the fact that I also so remember... We need concrete slab. Remember how uh, we were talking about ignore ice, which turned into ignore mud, which turned into ignore trees? Now, I've discovered a yep. new subset of that. Ignore guardrails. 
uh, we have a problem. A problem? Why's that? Yeah, there's no more, there's no more concrete slabs. Oh. <laughs> you, yeah, let me see if you have any on. I was gonna say, you might want to, like, check the other map before you rule it out completely. Exactly, Billy, exactly. Let's see. What's going on, Scarlet? I see you out there in the chat. Let's see. Can the crane on the Megabus be removed? Oh, absolutely, Truth. The crane and the rack can all be removed from this okay, thing. Okay, perfect. Concrete slabs are on the other map, but I have to be careful. There's only two left. Oh, oh. look. Con concrete Whoa. production. I don't know what the heck that was, but I... uh, This thing did not want to make a tight turn. It, it was, like, absolutely freaking not. Um, Why don't I just go straight, like, across this swamp? That makes, um, that makes more sense in my mind. Oh, the trailer doesn't like that. So I do have to kind of be careful about the fact that I've got a trailer back there, but I thought that this swamp was supposed to be, like, actually, you know, treacherous mud. Turns out, it ain't. <laughs> at all. Yep. At least not in the eyes of this beast. Now, which way should I be... Oh, I should be going that way. I should be turning right as quickly as humanly possible. Yeah, no worries, Truth Lies. And let's see, Brennan White, what's going on? I see you saying hi out there in the chat. Okay, so can we make it there? That's first question. Uh, I think I can, actually. I think we got a pretty solid route. So let's see. Oh, you left the low That's land. Link to the other map now. Yeah, I figured. God, I have to plan out my routes in such a weird way now. I mean, this makes you think of, like, not only the map, but, like, the entire game differently. It's just so weird, man. It's so weird. All right, coming down into the river now. And then I'm just going to go directly upriver. I, I have a feeling that that's going to be my only real, um, my only real plan of attack. So let's see. Um, we got Playless. I see you out there in the chat. We got Holly and Joe and, and Nash. K-Dog, what's going on, you guys? All right, can so we do all this? all the way out there. No. Um, the current is too strong to do this. Like, actually legitimately too strong. Well, I'm going to have to low figure plus? out a... No, like, low minus, low medium, low plus, all that. This thing cannot fight that current. So... Uh, I'm gonna have to go around the I mean, side. hearing that, I feel challenged, but... I'm sure you do, but trust me, it's, um... It's pretty nasty. Let's see, um... MJ, what's going on, dude? I see out there in the chat. Uh, what kind of engine is in this thing? A gigantic supercharged V8. Essentially a monster truck engine. Oh, come on. There we go. I'm not lying when I say this thing is, like, not too happy about what we're doing right now. Not too happy. And this current, holy smokes. I have never seen current like this in SnowRunner. I think I've found a little bit, a little bit of a patch of it that's pretty calm, but, like... I think that's the thickest tree I've ever pushed over in this game. The thickest tree? Yeah. Thick with five Cs or something? Yeah, probably, actually. That was a solid one, and it went down like a ton of bricks. Uh-oh. Uh, I think I had a problem r right there. Let's see, have you used the bus on Lime's Playground yet? Not yet, but make sure you hang around for that, because trust me when I say, that is coming. The Mega Bus isn't on consoles yet, but it'll be available soon. Absolutely. Have you been out this way yet? Which way? Uh, basically where I am. There's a broken power line out here. Oh, yeah. I went back there a while ago, and but I've only been back there, like, one time. Um, move this a little bit closer. Move you up and then down. And I'm just going to let that one chill. I'm going to let that chill, and then I'm going to go, and I'm just going to winch this thing because it needs it at this point. Can the winch overcome the current? I mean, barely. 
How is the cargo on the trailer still on? Bro, I don't even know. Eli Weber, what's going on out there in the chat? And Logan, what are the new console mods today? You can check the latest releases in terms of console mods via the link that is pinned at the top of the chat. And then this right here, Lime's Megabus, is a upcoming console-friendly mod project that will be on console as soon as it gets released and then, of course, approved by the developers. Now, upcoming as well, we have Dub's second-gen Dodge, which should be getting, um, should be getting released and tested by the devs on about Friday. So we'll see how that goes. And let's see... How's that? Yeah, dude, I don't know how that cargo's still on there. I genuinely don't. I, I really, I really have no clue. It is so incredibly next level. Uh, come on. I need you to pull me that way. Please? Well, a little bit of a word of advice here, Diesel. Don't go the way I went. Yep. It was a really bad idea. Like, go I'm talking like... I'm talking like horrible idea. Like actually slowed this thing down. Kind of horrible. Eli says, give it mm. the beans. And I'm like, bro, I am full, like flat out. I'm floored right now. Absolutely flat out in this thing. And uh, that's all the beans it's willing to give. Let me see. Maybe automatic mode? With a little bit of winch help? The only thing that's really hurting us is the fact that we're not, you know, uh, we're going against the current. We're not going with it. And so because of the fact that we're going against the current, it, the game is like, hey, I'm going to I'm gonna ask you to stop that right now. Laser winch right there. It was not too happy about all of those, like, trees getting broken one by one. But this thing was going to break them. I mean, that's like, that's like the long and short of how heavy this thing is. I wonder if this is, like, the heaviest thing in the game now. Or if this is the heaviest thing Limes has ever built. No, oh, I know, right, oh, that's Frog? that's a good question. Like, Frog said the fact that the trailer has stayed attached this whole time is, like, mind-boggling. And I'm like, yeah, it is. <laughs> I mean, at the moment, I don't have a trailer since I had mine get stuck. So I have literally oh, that's just... right. Like... Woo! I still didn't even dump the trailer. How I didn't dump the trailer right there, I don't even know. Wow, okay, that's so crazy. I have to deliver two. Oh let's yikes! See. I have to go there. Uh, let's see. ZK01 Gaming, what's going on, buddy? I see you out there in the chat. Rally Racer, welcome back to the stream. Thank you so much for stopping by. Great to see you out there. Okay, how close am I now? I'm getting there. Honestly, this might be a good place to cross the river. Oh, I'm doing it. I'm doing it, boys. I'm doing it. Let's go. Oh, my God. Oh, wow. Deeper than you thought? Um, much. Oh, no. It it undid the trailer. I lost everything in the... Oh, no. Bro, I lost everything in the river. They expected this. Uh-oh. Am I crashing the game? Okay, never mind. The devs expected this. Yeah, I had a little bit of a lag this. there, too. Um... Please. Okay, finally, I've got a winch point that works, but it's a little late for that. Dude, it, that winch won't even pull me. Oh my god, it won't even, it won't even pull me. Well, that's, I mean, that was as far as this thing was gonna go, I guess, without getting completely ruined. I don't know where my beams went, but they are not here anymore. Hammond! Yeah, I know. Trust me, I know. I'm almost to the other side, but I'm gonna see if the crane can reach to where those beams went, because... I mean, if they can, I'll rescue them, but let's see. Dude, absolutely, Sofa Soldier, 100%. No worries, guys. We will get this figured out. And if not, well, we'll go to a map that has some massive jumps on it. <laughs> oh, I'm in the spot. I'm in the spot. I'm in the spot. I'm in the... Oh, crap. <laughs> did you get oofed? Yeah, I did. Like, how bad? Uh, All things considered, it could have been worse. Okay, well, let me see if I can even remotely fish for these beams, but let's see. Dude, there's not even a single uh, pop-up for these beams anymore. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> oh, the beams are toast. Impossible to pack. Well, you know what's the funny thing is the cargo that I didn't pack is the cargo that stayed. That's literally yeah, that's... the cargo that stayed, was the cargo that wasn't packed. Oh my god. Yeah, that was, uh, yeah, that was like, okay, I'm not gonna let you, uh, I'm not gonna let you get your bus back up. 
I mean, my bus is like, fine. It's it's a fishing game I'm now, turtle. TC. Yeah, pretty much. Oh, you're, oh, are you turtled that bad? Yeah, I I am legit turtled. Jeez. And let's see what's going on, Oscar. I see you out there in the chat. And let's see, you guys should try to finish a highway hauling region. He says in all caps. Oh my. Do we have a little bit of a cut through that we can use right here? I think we do. I will drop off at, at the very least one oh no. Oh god, big lag. Did you get that? Uh not really, but I'm I'm moving extremely slow right now because I'm trying to get this thing back up right. Well, I'm gonna uh, drop off at least one unit of beams, and then from there we can go wherever we want. <laughs> yep. Let's see if that helps. Does that sound fair and agreeable to you? Yes, it does. Okay. All right. Easing this up and over. Yeah, this is stuck upside down. How badly stuck upside down is it? I'm winched to a solid tree, and it's not wanting to flip me at all. It's just sliding. Bruh. Well, I found a garage that I've never... Or not a garage, a, um, a gas station that I've never been to before, so that's kind of cool. Um... That out there. Oh, that's the wrecked truck. You know what I'm actually gonna do? I'm gonna pack this uh, on the trailer since I'm actually getting really close now to the drop-off point. And let's see. Wait, you know it was snorter because TC's cam was still moving. Wait, what? Huh? I thought you froze TC. I got scared. Oh yeah. Oh, that's what you mean, frog. I see. I see. I see. Um, let me just lower you down. Then I'm gonna drop it. And then once I get it uh, packed on the trailer, I'm going to drop it off. And then we'll go somewhere that A, isn't nighttime. And B, how do you feel, Diesel, about, like, going somewhere that has the ability to, like, give us some... Oh, my God, look at the lights on this thing. But, no, like, give us some mad crawling opportunities and also and also offer racetracks for the Mega Bus. That sounds good to me. Yeah be a nice change after this map absolutely like telling us no yeah th this one definitely told us no 100 percent. although i do want to pay a visit to our good old friend amandra yes only like if if nothing else but to just say hey amandra screw you <laughs> <laughs> yeah all right. Th this thing in a monstrosity are the best way to do that. All right. You ready to make a quick switch? Yeah, I I'm good. I'm stuck. I'm just dragging myself around here. Okay. Well, I'm going to go back to the main menu. I'm going to reset to the next day. Then I'm going to retain one of my mega buses, probably the one that I sank. And then I'm going to go to Imandra. And uh, we're going to essentially, essentially, like, probably try to get to as many places as possible that we've never been to before and go exactly where the game does not want us to go. Because the last time we went to Amandra, I remember, <laughs> I, I think it was us in like default-ish trucks and we were getting absolutely like just monstered by the map. Not so on this occasion, my yeah, dudes. Yeah, we were getting, yeah, we were getting wrecked. He says as he chugs coffee. Um, See, it's, you know what, actually, I want, I want a sticker for the side of that mega bus that says, hold my, hold my, uh, cold brew and watch this. <laughs> <laughs> okay. All right. We are retained. And now I am loading into, wait a minute. Oh God. I don't even have it unlocked on this save. What can you host? Do you have it unlocked? Actually, no, I don't. So that, means oh, yeah. I just noticed, uh, the updates for Grizzly and Juggernaut came through. Oh, they did? Oh, God. Um, so yep. that means... That means that there's a little bit of a... Uh, let's see. Holy crap, Oscar. That's freaking wild. Give her the veins! Yeah, exactly. Um, so let me see if mine are updating. Uh, well, they updated now. Um, but they're actually... They're downloading. And it must have been a gigantic update for Grizzly. Because the file size went way up like way yeah i can see that now 
way the heck up. Mine is currently installing, though. And let's see, Riley Fox says, hi, what's going on? I see you out there in the chat, my dude. I'm gonna actually check out what's new on the Grizzly real quick, because the Grizzly is coming to consoles um, probably next week. It's gonna be released on Friday, and then probably come to consoles uh, the week after that. Deadpool Raven, I see you out there in the chat. TC dropped me off at the wrong stop. What do you mean I dropped you off at the wrong stop? You told me to drop you off there. <laughs> Hush. All right, let me go ahead. <laughs> nah, you could actually, you know what? Just tell me what stop you want to be dropped off at, Ernest Horn. Just, just, just tell me what stop you want to be dropped off at, and then we'll see what we can work out from there. I'm going to load into the Proving Grounds and see what's new on that console-friendly second gen, as well as, uh, let's just say we're going to put it on top of the Mega Bus and see how long it lasts up there. <coughs> and let's see. Uh, Joe, what's going on out there in the chat? We got Caleb Thompson. We got uh, Lawman out there checking in. And let's see. TC, I'm getting some stream lag. Uh, refresh your stream or uh, back out and come back in um, because of, uh, obviously that happens uh, from time to time. It's most likely your internet, but uh, like check in on that and see how it goes. So let's see. Grizzly 3500 will set you right there. And then Megabus will set you right. Oh, God. We'll set you right here. And CK1500, we will delete you. Now, let's see if the update actually, like, made it to me. I mean, I guess it's, uh, was the normal default, uh, always method wheels? I feel like that's a new thing. Let's see. Off-road, slow trailing trans. Yeah, I think trans. that's new. Oh, that's gotta be new. Okay, yeah, this is all new stuff. Let's see. Drive the uh, Megabus into the Proving Ground Lake with the biggest T1s? Oh, definitely. The amount of batteries in the thing? I know, right? It's, it's a lot. Uh, let's see. Six-inch lift. And let's throw some some 44 inch uh, ko2s and we'll do like a scout offline power lockers gooseneck hitch factory bumper ra front bumper oh that's sick ra rear bumper drop hitch oh yeah this looks awesome factory exhaust with a tip or a um stack exhaust oh that's like an axle dump okay cool uh we'll throw the stacks in the back and then back glass you can apparently oh you could have tinted back glass kind of like the tinted back glass actually uh, let's see. Tinted windows halfway down. Tall snorkel. Cab lighting. Uh, let's see. Dually fenders. We don't need those right now, but flatbed would be cool. Oh, uh, well, that's a work in progress. Uh, we'll, 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 we'll get to those uh, a little bit later on. Um, let's run it in orange. Oh, this thing looks so good. And this thing's also going to be on consoles soon. Like, this thing is a beast. Oh, it's got that classic 12-valve sound, too. It sounds amazing. Oh, yeah. I'm going to let this guy chill out right here. No, I said chill out right here. And then we're going to do the biggest T1 tires. And let's see. All right. Max size T1s. Big boy engine. Or sorry. Big boy transmission. Tuned engine. Long strap. And let's see. Big boy suspension. And refresh that. Oh, I also need the crane because I want to put the second gen on top. And then now, oh wait, we need the towing suspension for that. Yep, tow crane. And then suspension up. And then crane mode. So now, the second gen is coming with me. Up you goes. Oh god, it actually does. Oh, so Jake, what is going on out there in the chat? Thank you so much for stopping by. Well, this worked actually a lot better than I expected it to work. Let's get you I think turned. you caught a second, Jen. I did. See, I went fishing, and I actually had a really good haul this time. I just realized all the fishing mini games we can play. <laughs> <laughs> Especially with things like the Tinka. Oh my god. Bro. Max Mike's RC pack in general. It's just the oh, yeah. it's just the speaking, fish pack now. Speaking of the RC packs, I can't get someone this to line took. Up. <laughs> somebody took the uh, the Tinka uh -huh. and they took Puppy Master's IX RC truck and they packed it on the back of the Tinka. No, they did not. Did they? Re That's insane. Yeah, it's it in it's in your server. Someone posted it in your server. I I need to see if I can actually, like, do that. I need to see if I can make that work. Yeah, I gotta... I gotta see if I can scroll through and find it. Let me see if I can... Also, by the way, this. Devs, if, if anybody's listening, 
it would be nice to have some sort of progress bar. There it is. Uh. So this is a fully like collision uh, area. I can drive around on top of the mega bus. Oh, jeez. All right, crane restored. And packed the second gen. <laughs> packed it. I packed it. Oh my god, I packed it. All right, play last. We will see when we get back. Thank you so much for hanging out while you could. Oh my god, I packed it. I I cannot get over what I'm able to do with this now. Wow. <laughs> the ultimate vehicle mover, mud truck, amphibious truck, monster truck, like, I, the ultimate everything. All right, y'all, you ready to turn this thing into a boat and cross a freaking lake? Or rather, a pond. Let's go. What? <laughs> it's floating. What? It's just floating. Well, maybe not completely, but... Wow, that was... That was insane. I, I've i never found something that can do the stuff that this does. It ignores mud, by the way. Even in high, it ignores... At least... Um, what's up? Yeah, I was going to say, I'm not surprised. Well, I mean, like, at least the mud that we just drove through, it ignores that. What about the deeper stuff? Because the deeper stuff... It might not be able to fully ignore it. Let's find out. Oh, uh, yeah, no, it ignores it. And it ignores it fully. In high. In high. What? Wow. I, I'm i speechless. And, like, for the amount of time I've been playing this game, like, to make me actually speechless is pretty, in like, insane. It's genuinely incredible. I... I haven't been speechless in SnowRunner in a very long time, and this genuinely makes me speechless. It went right through the mud, even the, like, insanely deep stuff in high, turned around, came back, went through the pond, and now it's driving through the entire river with a truck on top of it. I mean, I don't know where this... I don't know where the monster bus could go from here. I mean, who built this bus? Limes did. <laughs> Wherever it wanted. Exactly. Yeah, Limes built this bus, and it's going to be on console soon, actually, because all he needs to do is release it and uh, get it tested by the devs, and then it'll be good to go. It'll be console-friendly. Well, it is console-friendly, but it needs to be, in order for it to be on console, it needs to be approved, is what I mean. Now, I know that normally I would want to save the bridge jump for a video, but I think in this instance, I'm going to do a preemptive uh, bridge jump, and then in the future, I'm going to come back and do another one when it's time for the full video. So... Let's go with a slightly smaller set of tires, show you guys the amazing interior view, and then we're going to head up to the top of the ramp and see what happens when we launch this thing. Although, granted, um, the bus is protecting its young. Exactly. Um, but, uh, granted, this is not going to be the only jump we're going to do on this, uh, on this stream today with this bus. Absolutely not. So, I'm going to have to go smaller on the tires. They don't fit right now. So it's going to have to be on the smallest T1s, which are still massive. All right, let's hope we don't get snagged. It's getting snagged. Not for much longer. Boing! As if the bridge jump was going to be an issue for it. I mean, if you thought it was going to be an issue for it, you definitely had another, uh, another thing coming for you on that one. What about the mountain? How about uh, ignore That's mountain mode? So, uh, even on the smallest tires, I mean, maybe with, like, a tiny little bit of winching. Yeah, it's basically ignore mountain. <laughs> it's... All right, Paige Rogers, we'll I mean, see if we get back. I mean, ignore everything. Ig literally, yeah. Ignore, what, every single thing in the entire game? By the way, did your truck finish? Uh, no. None of them did, actually. Oh! And I... I think Frog is right, actually. We need a second gen. Or, excuse me, not a second gen, but an RC version. Oh, an RC version of this? Dude, ignore all. Yeah, pretty much. I didn't even see that he said that. Uh, RC version of this? I'm down for that. 
Uh, Inks a sneak peek. Uh, this is actually, yes, this is a sneak peek at what you guys will be seeing later on when the full version is done. Now, let me actually make a quick switch because I have a very uh, interesting idea. Is this school bus on console? Um, is the console second gen on console? So the console second gen should be coming, um, it should be getting released from Friday and then on consoles next week. And then the bus will be coming to console as soon as it gets approved, okay? And let's see, but can you ignore the trees? Uh, actually, yes. Um, so let me do a quick load up of TNB trails and you guys will see why momentarily now TNB trails has this lovely section called the desert jump and here's the thing the monstrosity is actually diesel in terms of our streams holds the record for the longest jump either of us has ever done I want to see if this bus can beat his record <laughs> I mean it probably can but as soon as I get back in to the game, we'll see if I can either push the record a little further or at least keep my title. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Somebody out there in the chat said um, an RC, who was it, Matt Hopper, said an RC version would basically be the size of a normal truck. <laughs> and he's not wrong. Like, if you use the size conversion ratio that they use for most RCs, let's see... Get into the garage and selling everything except for the little CK-1500. Okay. And actually... Alright, so let's spawn the bus in. And, well, wait a minute. Instead of spawning the bus in... Why don't I... Why don't I drone mode myself? And I'll actually spawn idea, actually. another... Um, another, like... CK-1500 or something, and they'll just, it'll just be chilling out here in case I need a, like, a, you know, like, a recover and retain type deal, but, um, let me switch back to the other one, and recover, retain, and then go back to the map, go back to this one, and then go to free cam, and drone mode my way out to the desert, where we will then spawn in the mega buzz. Actually, I'll spawn in a build, you want me to build you one as well? Just, like, identical setups? Um, uh, you know, that would probably be a good idea. Yeah, I'm down for that. Um, to just tell me what color you want, and then I'll get it, like, built right uh, out red. here at the... You want a red? Because I'm leaving mine, like, school bus yeah. yellow. Classic school bus yellow. Um, let's see. New console mods? Um, if you want to know the latest console mods that have just released, make sure you click the pinned link at the top of the chat. And if you want to know what mods are upcoming, uh, for consoles that will be coming soon, you got a second gen by Dubs that will be coming very, very soon, as well as the monster bus by Limes that will be coming very, very soon as well. Now, speaking of the monster bus, or the mega bus, I'm gonna spawn one right here for me, and another one right here for Diesel, and then I'm going to build them. So mine is going to be staying school bus yellow, and it's gonna get the rack removed, big boy gearbox, and tuned engine, and you want the largest monster tires or the largest T1s? I feel like the largest T1s are probably gonna be better for this. Yeah, I think the largest T1s, and I'm actually gonna restart my game and try and force it to re-download okay. the Forks new truck as well as the updates to the Grizzly and the Juggernaut. Alrighty, sounds good. I'm giving them both big boy suspensions, big boy gearboxes, and tuned engines. And, oh, let me give you uh, the long... Uh, I forgot to give you, or give myself, the long strap, um, the long toe strap, because the long toe strap is going to actually be really important for what we're about to start doing. Let me remove your... Um, your rack, and then you're going to get the largest T1s available. All right, and now that they're both, well, all right, and your bus is, well, that's not the right red. Hold on. It's probably one of these other reds. <laughs> Limes has a brighter red than the default red. There's that red, and then I'm going to swap wheels out to, uh, let's see, black and red wheels. Oh, dude, you've seen the black and red wheels, right? Well, yeah, I was running them when I got the bus stuck upside down. Oh, dude, that's so sick. What's up, Wesley? KSC out there in the chat. And let's see, what is this map called? This is TNB Trails, and it is available on all systems. Now, let's see. Um, same uh, same to that question, uh, Billy. And what's going on, Nate? OMGTC, I haven't watched you in four years uh, since Spin Tires. What happened to Spin Tires anyway? Oh, that's a... That is a long story, but essentially, um, Spin Tires came, and then Mud Runner came, and then Spin Tires was out of the picture for a bit, and then Spin Tires came back, and then, and then Snow Runner came out, and then Spin Tires went away 
again, and that's its current state now. Um, 985 Cam, what Pretty is going much, on, yeah. my dude? And Lime says, put the crane on for extra distance. How do we get the bus? Uh, you'll be able to get the bus publicly on mod.io on both PC and consoles as soon as Limes is done with it, and he releases it to everybody. So, the crane for distance, huh? So, rack and crane, then, on both vehicles. I guess the extra weight makes it go farther because it would pick up more speed. That makes sense. Um, all right, so the red one in is theory. yours. Yeah, in theory, at least. Um, the red one is yours. The yellow one is mine. All right, so those are going to chill for right now. And then, uh, as I wait for you to get those downloaded, I'm going to actually hit the jump in the monstrosity because I want to set a benchmark, right? I want to set a benchmark in the yeah. monstrosity. Now, if I could only find where the monstrosity was in the spawn list because... Finding the monstrosity in the spawn list is like finding a needle in a haystack considering how many mods I have. There it is. Also, for those of you that are just joining us, look at the dang size comparison. Like, suspension ultimate monstrosity. Uh, let's see. Largest, uh, largest narrow wheels and tires. And let's see. Highway gearbox. All the power. I mean, beans on dash. This is an ult this is about as ultimate as monstrosity gets and it's still not on the level of that mega bus. Even when I put the suspension into high mode, it's still not the same. Look at this size comparison. It's just nuts. Yeah, I passed it. Oh, I know. Please tell me that's on console. Well, Luke, um the bus will be making its way to console as soon as Limes is done with it and of course he releases it to the public. Monstrosity is still longer. It does have that. It does have that on the Megabus, but that's about the only thing it has on the Megabus at this point. It might be faster, but, I mean, that's, that's actually, I didn't even think about that, but we should kind of, we should drag race them to see which ones are, uh, which one's actually faster. Yeah, if we're gonna drag race them, we probably should do that on the Northport Alaska map, on the, uh, yes. airstrip jump. I agree. I 100% agree. And let's see, Lorson, what's going on out there? Welcome back to the stream. I see you saying hi in the chat. And Hunter Griffiths, what's that map called that you're on? Oh, once again, this is TNV Trails, buddy. I'm going to make my way up to the top here. We got beans on the dash for good luck, as always. Giving her a good old yeet. All right, now, Diesel, when you do a run down the, yeah. the TNB uh, Trails Desert Jump in the Monstrosity, do you put it in high or automatic or neutral? I let it go in... I run it in automatic probably about halfway down the jump. Uh-huh. And then right toward the bottom of the jump, slam it into high, and it takes off. All right, then. Actually, three, about three quarters of the way down the ramp. Two, one. Well, never mind. We're already going. Okay, so automatic. Hi, let's go. Oh, my God. Woo! Well, we center. Probably not as far as yours went, but... Okay, so we're on the road past the swamp. We're, like, I remember you landed at that factory one time... But there's our current benchmark for, like, jump flight distance. Um, yeah, now, that, that's pretty much where I ended up. Yeah. Because technically there was a bounce around that spot, and that's how I got to the factory. But that's oh, roughly where okay. I ended up without a bounce. That's fair. Actually, I can see the monstrosity from here. That's that's really funny. That's really, really funny. Matthew Price, uh, or Prince, sorry, what's going on out there in the chat? I see you saying hi. And let's see. Um, yes, Beans, give it the beads. Playlist says Beans is nodding at you. Yeah, he's like saying, yes, good job. Good job. I approve. I approve of this. Um, let's see. What are the new mods? Uh, if you want to see a list of the latest console mods that are available, make sure you click the pinned link at the top of the chat. And the, the latest mods that are going to be on their way in terms of development are going to be uh, Dub's second gen. And there's also this guy, the Monster Bus, which will be on console as soon as uh, Limes is finished developing it. And then, of course, the developers approve it. So let's see. Do you think a rear steer low boy trailer would be a good idea for a mod? That would be uh, that'd be an interesting one. Darl, thank you so much. And let's see, Ashton and Bryce, what's going on? See you saying hi out there in the chat. Who remembers the spin tires mega dump truck? I think I do. I'm, pr I'm pretty dang sure I do. Uh, get beans on the way down the jump, right? Oh boy. All right, should I do a test hit in the bus or should I wait until, should I save that until we can be in multiplayer with each other? Because I'm, I'm, I'm really, really, really like torn on that. What do you think, Diesel? I mean, I say, I say send it because at the moment it doesn't look like I'm going to get done with mod updates anytime soon. So. Oh no! 
All right, we're sending it then. If you say send it, we're going to send it. Chase says, don't wait. And I'm like, fair enough. Um, let me change the suspension mode and put it... Oh. Oh, that's going up. I thought I was going to put it down, but no. That's, uh, that's not how that was going to go. Now, wait a minute. Should I have the fast gearbox for this? Or the big... Probably fast. I would assume uh, fast. Hmm. That, that, the, the fast makes more sense in my head. At least I think yeah, it makes fast, more sense. Yeah, the fast, I would think, would be the one to go for. Okay, Lime says fast. Yeah, okay, he said fast. That's what I figured, but I just wanted to make sure. Let's see, what happened to the F-350? Can someone answer this? Uh, yes, I can, actually. So the F-350 ended up getting removed by the developers. Uh, apparently there was uh, something something uh, not fully approved about the mod, um, but uh, Red re-released it, and hopefully it'll make its way back to the console mod browser in its updated state. So, oh god. The crane on the back is making it so that I can barely make it up this hill. Like, I have to uh, have a winch connected in the front to even make it, like, able to drive. Come Oof. on. I mean, even so, I'm barely going anywhere. Let's see, didn't you have a Miata that you made very few videos on? I did, so here's how, uh, here's how the Miata went. So I bought the Miata, and I, uh, I made a few videos about it, like a couple, not that many. I made a couple of videos about the Miata. I uh, put wheels, tires, and uh, like a, a Nine Lives Racing wing on it. I did a couple of track events in it. And then a buddy of mine was like, hey, I'm I'm like really looking to get into track days. I'm looking for a well set up Miata. And at that point, I was actually moving into some builds on some other cars. And I was like, perfect. You can buy this one if you want it. And he was like, deal. I was like, okay. But you know what's the coolest thing about that car is the <laughs> fact that like he still uses it for track events very regularly. And I've actually like... I've driven it, like, again, under his ownership. I've gotten to ride in that car at, like, several events. I actually rode in it at Barber Motorsports Park when I was there in the BRZ recently. So, really, really cool stuff with that car, actually. That Miata actually uh, has, at this point, I want to say it has just under 280,000 miles on the original engine. Um, and it's still, it's still taken away. It's still doing track events. It's still, it's still sending it, essentially. All right, boys. I've had my coffee. We ready to have this, uh... Wait, Dev tools the crane off. I should have done that. Squidward Diesel, what's going on out there in the chat? Thank you so much for stopping by. All right, so I have a question for you. Before we send this, do we need to put the Eevee hat on before this becomes a thing? Yes. We have to? Okay. All right, give me a second. Yes. We're going to grab the Eevee hat then. All right, let's see. All right. So, we've got the Eevee, and uh, it's not necessarily designed to be a hat, but uh, it's going to go on my head, and whatever happens during this jump, we're going to see if it can survive. Now, if I can keep this on my head for the entirety of this jump, well, I don't know. There might be some kind of, uh, there might be some kind of uh, celebration involved, but we'll see. All right, let me fire it up. I love how everybody out there in the chat is like, oh, you better. All right, firing it up. Oh, God. I'm scared. I'm very scared. Going. Going. Holy crap, we are gone. Um, limes it. Oh, God, there goes Evie. Um, I'm, I'm not so... Well, it's still going. Okay, I think... I think I actually might need to take the crane off. I legit think I might actually need to take the crane off. Empower says, this vehicle, thinking confused. Um, so this it's, vehicle... It's Empower's new favorite. <clears throat> Excuse me. Wow, I don't know where that came from. Yeah. But it's Empower's <laughs> new favorite. It is Empower's <laughs> new favorite, indeed. All right. I've uninstalled the Mega Crane and the Rack because I have a feeling that they actually slowed me down because it made the whole bus lean uncontrollably backwards um, like the second I left the jump. So I'm going to go back up and try that again in my current state um, with the suspension in low mode, but I just got to remember to put it back into high mode when I get to the top. Let's see, how are you doing? Okay, still in morning time. What do you mean? It's just the Baja bus. It's fine. It's just making its way through the dunes. Don't worry <coughs> about it. Uno reverso card. Yeah, just about. Oh, no. 
Oh, through some, yep, there we go, through some tricky ninja winching. We made our way back to our wheels, and let's see. Been here from the start, gotta run. All right, man, we will see when we get back, Ground Vic. We will see you next time. Let's see. Uh, Sean uh, Swaffold, what's going on? And Ethan, I see you checking in out there in the chat. Evie, no. Yeah, just about. Oh, my God. I mean, I've got two plushies back there in my, uh, like, my stream shelf, essentially. There's an Eevee, and there's an Eevee and a Corgi, and I don't know if the Corgi plush is actually big enough to go on my head. All right, let's put this thing in low plus and see if it'll maintain that all the way up the hill. Hello, bus passengers. Sorry about your hearing. We don't offer uh, included ear protection. Never mind that the, the headers dump out right by the windows and the freaking supercharger would probably deafen everybody on the bus. <laughs> I wonder... <laughs> Pretty much. Bro, I wonder if on a small tire, if you could make this thing cyclone. That would be so sick to see. I mean, I'm sure it can. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. All right, Timmy Miller, we will see when we get back, buddy. By the way, y'all are creeping up on that 400 likes mark on the stream. That's freaking legit, y'all. What's up, Marcus? I see you saying hi out there in the chat. All right, attempt so we number two. we have an accomplishment. Do we do? The Grizzly 3500 has finished downloading. Let's freaking get it, dude. Juggernaut and the uh, Glitchworks Peterbilt are the only ones left. All right. I'm sending it. No crane this time. High mode of the suspension. Oh, this might be the one. Oh, this is the one, dude. <gasps> oh, Holy with a bounce. Cow. With a bounce. Factory. Um, I passed the factory. I'm in the woods behind the factory. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Challenge accepted. As Look soon how as, far I uh, flew. <laughs> oh my god all right i'm gonna change the setup on your mega bus slightly i'm gonna remove your rack and your crane because i know for a fact that those don't okay. help <laughs> yeah that's uh <clears throat> that's something <laughs> yeah so yours is just chilling out here it's ready and do you know if the f450 will be on consoles uh which one the one in the thumbnail uh, that one is a uh that one is a pc one but this bus will be on console and dubs second gen will be on console soon as well now let's see by the way y'all just blew through that first uh, that 400 likes mark on the stream thank y'all so much what in the hell did i just witness well empower um <laughs> you know what you witnessed the future right <laughs> Oh, greatness. Well, there's that, too. <laughs> uh, let's see. Hey, what's up, Gunner Love and Timothy Metcalf? I see you checking in. We got Garrett and Glitch out there in the chat as well. Um, oh, really, Limes? Wait, let's see. Make it tinted separate from the rest of the glass. Doodle, what's going on, dude? And, oh, my God, Barnett said, <laughs> is, oh, yes. <laughs> oh, that's amazing. That is wild, Chuck B. That's so insane. Garrett and Chase, what's going on, you guys? See you checking in out there in the chat. All right, it's time for another coffee chug. Maybe that will speed up Diesel's internet. Yeah, that would be nice if it would. Woo! All right. Um, <laughs> whoo! Okay, well, I am. All I'm gonna, all I'm gonna level. say, Empower, to help you with that, is just wait for Monstrosity 3.0. Yeah, My exactly. Um, there you go. What's going on, Rick? I see out there in the chat. And uh, wait. It was supposed to be, oh, yeah, something. Ethan, Ethan watched that jump, and he goes, FedEx drivers be like. <laughs> <laughs> Why you gotta call FedEx out like that? <laughs> Why? Why? Oh God! All right. Now before Diesel gets in here, I wonder. I have a uh, an idea for something else I could send off of that massive jump. Now, if I could find it, let me see. I don't know where. I don't know where it's gone. I don't know where it's gone actually at all. Um, it's, it's supposed to be in this list, but it's not the power wagon and it's not the, oh God, bro, where the heck is it off? Oh, no, 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 no. Where the heck is the other vehicle? Not more like Swift drivers. Yeah, there you go. I saw it on the thumbnail. I thought it was just damage XD. Yeah. I mean, hey, it, it happens. Oh, there it is. There it is. All right. This is one of Frog's work-in-progress rigs, a 
full-size invasion super duty which looks incredible by the way absolutely insane this is the first time i've ever brought this thing out on stream and it is beautiful let's see this is my first time uh oh first tc stream and i'm subscribing to your channel i love it thank you so much i'm gonna say i'm sending this vid to pixel monkey as soon as he's off work if he doesn't watch it soon i need Wait, I need a timestamp? Oh, like, uh, trust me, I'll probably end up clipping that uh, that portion of the jump myself. Let's see. Probably just a bone location, quick fix. Yeah, exactly. I'm ready to go trailing with it. Bro, I want to send this thing off the mega jump and just see what happens. I know it's not going to go, like, obviously as far as the other two. But, I mean, it's no mega truck. But, let's see. No damage. And let's throw, I don't know, something. Oh, I forgot that, like, you put the, um... You put the uh, the largest tires at the top of the list. I think that is a absolutely, like, brilliant idea, by the way. I love that. I absolutely love that. That's the best thing. The best freaking thing. Let's see. Oh, that's, that's, that's very green. What about preset four? Where's... Ooh, look at that. That's a lot of purple. I dig the orange. The orange is, is really nice. Find some off My eyes wheels. hurt from seeing that purple. <laughs> Do they really? You just really not like that purple? <laughs> I, I will say this, and I'm surprised nobody has said it yet. I deleted pink and purple from Punisher's lineup of colors. <laughs> oh, the, the man actually deleted the colors. Oh, my God. Hold yes. on. <laughs> uh, and that's going to be the same way on all my trucks going forward. That's hilarious. That is absolutely freaking hilarious. Wait. Let's see, you see the stock one, it has the not offset wheels first. Yeah, no, I actually saw, I, so I went through the options on it, and uh, that thing looks sick. The stock one, love it. Absolutely love that. Alex says, Russian tech. Uh, I don't know, The that that bus is, um, you want to talk about tech? That's um, that's full-on Murica Mudbog tech right there. This is going to be, this is going to be an interesting time getting up this hill. I'm going to put it in high and just, oh, wow, okay. Yeah, with the grip of these Patagonias and all this power, it just hauls. Oh, God. By the way, Diesel, so I don't another know if you've milestone seen... Oh, a milestone. What was that? Yep. Juggernaut finished downloading. Oh, he's getting closer. Have you seen, uh, by the way, Diesel, have you seen this Milestar Patagonia um, uh, tire tread that he has on this uh, F250? 250 slash 450? Honestly, no, I haven't seen it just yet. But I've heard of Milestar, so they should be pretty good. Oh, they're 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 awesome. Let's see. Someone should make a Nissan Figaro mod. If they did that, it better be a monster truck. Let's see. Um Oh god, Driven Miller, what's going on, buddy? I say out there in the chat. Call it big tech. Yeah, right. Um, where is my I feel like my snow runner volume just like lowered itself again. I'm turning it back up. You know why? Because I'm not letting it do that. Alright, here we go. I'm putting it in neutral. Yeah, just neutral full send. This might actually go farther than I, I than I think it will. It's gonna make it past that second dude. Oh no, it's not. <laughs> I love how yeah, it's that still power running. Is heavy. Oh, yeah, that was a good hit. <laughs> I love how it's still running. Bro, I didn't get any damage from that at all. I mean, now obviously I have the no damage suspension on, but I didn't get any like engine transmission, nothing, nothing. Let's see. The one in the thumbnail, will there be a console-friendly version? Um, not of the Ford, but the the Mega Bus, the, or the Monster Bus, just to say. Uh, Monster Bus, Mega Bus, whatever you want to call it. That is a console mod, and it will be getting released to the public and then tested for console very, very soon. So this, I'm actually going to delete real quick. I'm going to remove it. And I want to try one more shot at that jump in the monstrosity, because I have a feeling I might be able to beat it. Let's see. Ease it back on down. Let's see. Oh, B Gamer says, have you used my TTC truck yet? I haven't seen anything. And uh, the answer to that is actually no. I have not driven your TTC truck yet. I've been really busy driving a bunch of other trucks lately. But um, it's definitely on my list to drive for sure. I wonder if I can make it over like a bunch of these jumps in one shot with like, well, actually, I made it pretty far. Although I am going to flip. But because of the way the center of gravity of this thing is literally in the ground, I should be fine. And clearly I am. How do you get the Proving Grounds on console? Straight to your yep. mod browser. Hit Y or Triangle if you're on, like, Xbox or PlayStation. And then just click uh, Select Map and then Summer Testing Grounds. And what's up, Jenny Cole? Let's see you out there in the chat. Oh, my God. Empower's like, I wish there was a scrapyard in SnowRunner. I would put so many trucks in there. 
And I'm like, well, you know what? Yeah, starting with the loaf. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, yeah. The loaf would be king of the scrapyard. <laughs> <laughs> yep. Followed closely by the, um... Oh, God, what's the other... What's that one, um... Apache. The what? Apache. Oh, yeah, there's that, and then there's the one, um... Oh, I can't remember what it is. It's a, like, base game modified vehicle that, like... I, I don't remember what it's called off offhand, but, like, the tire grip is ice. Like, absolute ice. Oh, I can't think of that one off the top of my head. I know the one you're talking about, but it's it, right? awful. I know! Drive the bus? Oh, don't worry. We'll be getting back into the bus very, very soon. All right, let's ease it back on down. I really want to see if I can beat... Uh, well, maybe not beat the bus's distance, but get somewhat close to it. Full sendage? Oh, that was a good launch. That was a really good launch. That was. That's farther than the first run. There's a bounce. There's another bounce. So not quite to the factory, but like, if you look at the distance, there's the mega bus, and there's the monstrosity. So like, it's a, it's a pretty decent, like, it's a pretty decent spread, especially like in terms of distance. Like, wow. How is your, um, wait, let's see. Rosa oh, yeah. R7, uh, what's your opinion on the Lotus Avaya in Forza Horizon 5? Personally, it's my absolute favorite machine. I haven't personally driven the Avaya yet. I don't know if that's how you pronounce it or not. That's how I pronounce it. Ethan, what's good? What's that F2, uh, F350 in the thumbnail? 350, 250, 450? I mean, you know, kind of an in-between of all of them. But, um, <laughs> but as far as that goes, Rose, I need to drive it to get a... Uh, educated opinion on it, I would say. But let's see, if I use Punisher in campaign, it would be similar to deleting it. Oh my god, Empower! Okay, alright, uh, uh, okay, I see how, I see how it's going here. Alright, let me actually reset to the morning, and let me go back to the Megabus, and while, um, uh, while we wait on the last of Diesel's progress, speaking of the Punisher, that gave me an idea. I've never, wait, let's see, a racer two on Forza this week. Oh, yeah, for the weekly thing. Yeah, right? Um, I need to finish some of them as well. Yep. FNAF Gamer, what's good? I see you saying hi out there. And what's up, Diesel? Yeah, I was just going to say that if you want to jump Punisher, let, um, pop it into high gear to build it up into the higher gears first. And okay. then when you're going down the hill, let it, let it go into eighth. Eighth is like rocket mode. Oh, God. Okay. Josh Chadwell with that 499 Super Chat. Thank you so much. He says, hey, TC. What's up, man? Thank you so much for stopping by. We got Rose R07 saying you pronounced it correctly. <laughs> you pronounce it correctly. <laughs> yeah, pretty much. Yeah, thank you so much. I'm actually, I, I did not know whether or not I was pronouncing it correctly. So nice to get some clarification on that. Um, so let's see. Uh, you, what did you want me to do with um, with the, the Punisher? So Max, Max Engine the highway transmission and the all-purpose transmit uh excuse me uh suspension <laughs> the all-purpose <laughs> yeah english mode enabled yeah english mode and all right suspension high and then yeah highway suspension a engine three just da3 yeah and then can i uh i'm just gonna take the bumper completely off and then yeah, that would probably be best Okay, and then uh, tires-wise, let's see. I'd go for the taller Tatras, if I were you. So the 60, the, the dot six eight Tatras? Yeah. Okay. And I need to find a cool color for it. Let's see, what kind of color would look good? I mean, that's a green, but like, I want something that's like, that, that like all mods downloaded a little bit all mods downloaded bro let's freaking go sarah han whose ford is in the thumbnail that is actually yeah buddy's ford um more on that very very soon so let's see i am going to give this thing a run down the jump and then it's gonna be time for you and i to jump in to this lobby and have a jump off all right, what's going on, Kyle Plays? With that 999 Super Chat, your live streams are awesome, TC. Keep up the great content, man. Thank you so much, Kyle, by the way. I really, uh, really, really, really appreciate your support on the stream and support on the channel. Um, let's see. The Force is a really good truck for Maine. Um, it, it, may, it may very well be. So Except for when, you know, the river pushes it. Yeah. So you said on the way down, Diesel, you said... Um, oh, what's up, Larson and Bob? Is he guys saying hi? But no, you said automatic to high, back to automatic? Pretty much, yeah. You want it to be in eighth gear when you hit the bottom of the ramp. That should be most of your speed right there. Okay, that makes sense to me. 
You know, I gotta say, this thing actually looks really good with the Tatra Force tires. Like, it looks so right on here. So right. Let's see. Yeah, that was one of the things I was trying to go for. Exactly. Um, Josh Adbo, once again with that uh, 499 Super Chat, what did I miss? Um, well, I'm not sure when you were last here, but we are currently jumping some incredible mods out here on the TNB Trails map at the Dune Jump, including the Mega Bus and the Monstrosity, and now Diesel Addict's Punisher, and we are about to jump back into multiplayer with Diesel Addict after he updated a couple of mods. So let's see. William McGarrett, what's going on, dude? And, uh, yeah, Frog, no, no chassis flex on Punisher. All right, let's see... Uh, somebody out there was saying hi, Muddy Fox 22. What's good? I see you saying hi in, uh, in the chat. Sup, but adrift. All right, up on to the top of the hill. All right, Diesel, you ready? Oh yeah. Have you ever tested this before? No, I have not actually. What's your guess or guesstimation? My guesstimation is it'll clear the dunes, but that's pretty much it. I'm guesstimating three quarters of the way through the dunes, but not all the way. Let's see. Tim and Ethan, what's good, y'all? What is going on out there? We'll get, welcome back. All right. Whoa. All right. So automatic to high to automatic. Well, I don't think I'm going to need to go into high. It's already in seventh, buddy. Um, oh, there's eight. Yeah, it was, it was honestly way, way faster the way I had it originally tuned. Oh, really? But I dialed it back to keep it a little bit more... Saying it was uncontrollable even for me. Oh God! Okay, that's saying something. All right, so yeah. I'm gonna actually. <laughs> so I've got your mega bus right here. I'm gonna reset it to six o'clock in the morning, and then I'm going to probably go back to my little CK fifteen hundred. I'm gonna recover, retain, and then go straight to multiplayer. So let's see. Return to main menu, and we're gonna fire up a multiplayer session in the early morning on TNB Trails with the Mega Buses, and it's gonna be wild. Okay, so you want me to? Do you want me to turn on uh, the GWC three fifty nine? Yeah, you can turn that one on. I have it now. Okay, so I've got that on, and we should be good to go. Fire up co-op TNB Trails mods on and loading. Loading. Let's see. Who remembers? Pat oh. Wait, what? All right, go ahead. All right, go ahead. So just somebody out there in the chat said, uh, who remembers potato trees? I don't know what he means by that. <laughs> <laughs> Neither do I, honestly. And, uh, yeah, Frog, what do you mean by, eventually, which one are you talking about? Chassis Flex or the high-speed transmission? I think he's probably referring to Chassis Flex. Because I think, yeah. like, he really, you know, like... I mean, and I don't blame him for geeking out on the Chassis Flex. Because Chassis Flex is a really cool element of a truck. But, like, I feel like... I don't know. I feel like on a truck like Punisher, I don't know. I go back and forth on whether or not it would be helpful on a truck like that. Maybe more on something like a like a future mega crawler project or something like that. Well, the thing is, and as Puppy Master said a minute ago, it was it was rather advanced. It was beyond my skill at the time. And I've been looking into how to do it for things like Doomsday as well as my upcoming semis. And once I've learned how to do it, I'll probably go back and add it to Punisher as well. Oh, that's fair. Yeah, that's that's completely fair. What's going on, Chad? Ethan? <laughs> that bus is big. Oh, it's a, it's freaking big. Yeah, it's it's mega. Um, let's see, JB, what's going on out there in the chat? And talked. Oh, Doctor Jekyll fifty one coming in with the uwu in the chat. <laughs> oh my God. Uh, Dash says get a Toyota pickup. Actually, it's your lucky day because we have basically the the equivalent of my tundra in the game so we're definitely going to be building that as well but i've already got the mega bus on this map and i'm actually going to uh get mine out of the trees because diesel addict should now be here currently joining i haven't gotten the loading screen saying you've joined yet so we'll see in a minute okay i'm currently like i said fishing mine out of the trees hey there he is Name it. we gotta launch the 359 as well because i've never launched that out here like even once Oh, yeah, the 359 oh. will definitely be fun. My freaking monstrosity, the poor thing, is like, it's just on its side. Although I may have just pushed it upright. Yep, I just near enough pushed it upright. As soon as I uh, switch into it, I guarantee you it'll, it'll just fall back onto its wheels again. But mega bus time. And now that you're in and you've, like, fully moved to the map, you can literally just switch to the red mega bus that I have already pre-built for you out here on the... Uh, on the dune section. Okay, and then I'll jump into Monstrosity and see what happens there, because I flew that far with the big tractor tires. Yeah. 
and I wasn't using those. I was using the kind of like the um the patty tires. But let's see. Um, this is my new crawler. Yeah, exactly. Oh, there he is. Yeah, and there's the foghorn. Let's freaking go. Now, what was I gonna say? I literally. Oh my god. I literally fell. Oh my god. He said he fell asleep and then woke back up again. Or they did scarlet beans. <laughs> <laughs> That's hilarious. Let's see. Also, I should have a two-week break from work starting in a couple of days, which is nice. That's awesome, Rose. Congrats. I'm sure you're going to enjoy that. Is the Mega Bus on console? It will be as soon as um, as soon as it gets approved by the devs, and of course, as soon as Limes is finished developing it. When is the, uh, the Monster Bus coming out? Um, Limes doesn't have a definitive release date for it yet, but I can't imagine it's all that far off. Let's mm. see. Oh, God. See what I told you about climbing this hill? Yep. I'm going to back up. So I, you I might want to get a run at it and high off of this dune and I think you probably had the same idea. I'll back up over it so you can be where I am. Yep. Whoa, front axle up. I would recommend doing it in low mode on the suspension, not high mode, so you have less chance of flipping backwards. You know what I mean? Yep. So this is automatic. It does not like high gear, at least with the 10 speed. Oh, I'm on the 8 speed, the fast. Yep. Well, the 10 speed was in this one when I got here, so... Oh, that doesn't make any sense. It should have been on the fast. I'm sorry. I mean... Yeah, that's fine. Although, you could probably buy your own in the garage and monster truck it out here in, like, two seconds. Probably could. Well, this will be interesting to see, because I didn't realize you had the 10 speed. I am so sorry. Yeah, that's fine. All right, well, you go first, then. Okay, sounds good. I'm raising into high mode, and let's see... Like, best mod ever. Oh, my God. I think it's just... Oh, God. Uh, oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm going to back up. I'm going to back up. Hang on. Okay, there we now, go. I was kind of wondering what was going on there. Yeah, you were lodged so in my tire. See. All right. Good luck with this, by the way. All right. He's going to fly. I'm kind of looking in that general direction right now. He's flying. He's flying. Oh, my God. He's going to hit the swamp. All right. Actually, kinda... nope. Okay, so end of I the I landed dudes. perfectly. But he landed perfectly and drove away! Dude, that's amazing. That's amazing. That's incredible. Okay. So let's ease I'm her on down. I'm going to leave that one there. And I'm going to build my own monstrosity as well as my own okay. uh, bus. Full send! Oh, I am, like, flying so level right now. I'm going to land, like, exactly where... Oh, bounced, but I landed almost exactly where yours was. Essentially. Hmm. I almost wonder. Let me try something slightly different. And now for something that's slightly different. Oh, God. Look at it. The garage. Uh, you can't even see what color you're making the dang thing because it's just... <laughs> it's It just sits there. It's just like, oh, okay... Yeah, this is just how we work now. Um, I'm going to switch up my... Um... I just realized we haven't flung the second gen here, have we? Not yet, but we're going to. Is this map on console? Absolutely it is. It's called TNB Trails, bro. All right. I've got the radioactive green on this thing now, and I've got the black deep dish wheels. And raise it up. And let's see. Holy crap, that's big. I mean, yeah. Yeah, it's big. It's it's huge. It's huge. Hang on. I want to drive on top of the barn, or at least I want to see if it's possible to drive on top of the barn. I've low-key always wanted to do this, and I've never had something that I think could just, like, do it. But, because I don't think the monstrosity has ever done that. Uh, I'm not sure, actually. That's actually probably the one building I've never tried to park on. Oh, I flipped backwards. I think I might uh, have the suspension too high. Let me raise it back. Or, like, lower it back down. Easy. You know, monstrosity, uh... Wait. You, oh, you need a monstrosity in order to get in the Megabus. Yeah, just about. <laughs> or a jetpack. Jetpack would work, too. Alright, come on. I want to get you up here. Oh. I'm probably going to have to winch tie to something over here. 
Just to, like, just to keep it from... Yep, there we go. Well, uh, the CDT is weird, but, uh, but we're up. <laughs> we're on top of the barn. Ah, that's amazing. That green, love it. Let's see. And you need a Monster Max 2 to get in Monstrosity. Yeah, pretty much. It's just like a big ladder. You know what I mean? It's like Monster Max to Monster Max 2 to then Monstrosity to then the Mega Bus. It's literally just a big ladder. Parked, exactly. Cool startup sound. I know, I freaking love it. Really cool startup sound. Also, if y'all haven't seen the interior on this thing, it's amazing. It's got like actual little dash. It's got like a radio. You know, you've got your like control panel right here. Your freaking gear stick the like school bus door and then you've got the exposed supercharger on top of the engine back there it's it's nuts it really is are you still in the garage diesel no oh, i'm actually driving monstrosity out to the jump oh um i must not have like seen you leave are you already like i was actually right behind you oh never mind i remember now good lord okay uh let me see if I can, um, also, Catboy said, did you, did you see what I asked in chat? I did not, but I'm going to, uh, I'm going to keep an eye out for it, okay? Um, sorry about that. And let's see. Um, all right, gotta go. It was nice hanging out with, uh, hanging out while I, while I could. No worries, Rose Blue. We'll see you when you get back. Hope everything goes well. What's up, Fisher? I see you out there in the chat. All right, let me make a little bit of a, uh, a little bit of a run out to that mega jump real quick. Or I should say mega dune. Mega dunage. Doonage of doomage. There we go. Or just Dune of Doom. Where did you... What are you getting now? My bus. <laughs> Ew. Well, I guess... I mean... You mean what? <laughs> well, we kind of need a comparison with how I build. Ah, uh, yeah. I just realized I left, the rack on, I left the rack on the roof of this bus. Oh, well. Yeah. Just chat about what did I miss with the 499 Super Chat. Thank you so much. And as far as what did you miss? Well, uh, Diesel's mods finished downloading. And so now we're back in multiplayer together. And we are on our way to the Dune of Doom in our mega buses. And apparently Diesel has built his a little bit differently than I have built mine. So, oh, oh yes. Oh yes. What's up, Levi Ward? I see you checking into the chat. It doesn't Ouch. fully fit on the bridge. Uh, be forewarned. Love the freaking foghorn, though. The foghorn is the best. Yeah. Oh, crud. Don't flip, don't flip, don't flip. I flip. Wait, let's see. Oh. I'm back up again. Is the Mega Bus on console? Uh, not yet, but it will be as soon as Limes is uh, is finished with it. It is, uh, a, it is being built as a fully console-friendly mod, and then it just has to get tested and approved by the devs. But it's actually pretty low space usage and low RAM usage, so I don't think it'll have any issues uh, with performance on console for sure. Oh, that works. Nice and easy. I don't know which horn you're talking about, Frog. Oh, you mean the one on the... Oh, yeah, I mean, I... I, 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 yeah. I know which one you're talking about. Never mind. I had to think about it for a minute. Let's see. What map am I on? Well, Trevor, this is TNB Trails, and I'm going to take a quick shortcut. The Mega Bus doesn't need to follow the road. The Mega Bus does what the Mega Bus wants to do. The Mega Bus wants to go this way, and that's the way the Mega Bus is going to go. Is Diesel behind me? Yeah, I took a second to check something. Oh, okay. I'm going to wait for you to come around the corner because I, I want to see you fly over the, um, like, fly over that corner. Well, I just want to see you emerge. <laughs> All right, let's see it, boys. Let's see it, boys. So, TC, do you and Diesel have Pixel's newest map? Uh, which one? Which one? Because we've got the uh, the Desert Proving Ground Stage 1. I've, I've made, uh, like, several videos there. I love that place. Yep, he's down. I'm stuck on a tree. I love how we, like, switched roles from how I was all about the yellow, like, school bus style paint job, and then now I'm the one with, like, black wheels and lime green, and you're the one that's, like, all set up like a mega school bus. Yeah, the mega school bus, it was like, do I want to change the color? No. It'll probably be easier to see going across the desert anyway. Yeah. Wait, let's see. The one after that, the trailing one? Uh, I don't think we... I mean, Diesel, you can chime in on this as well, but I think... Um, I think Desert Proving Ground Stage 1 is the is the newest pixel map that I have. I believe it is off the top of my head. Yeah, because Frog is saying there's, a, there's another one after that. It's probably, like, currently still in development or still private, but I don't... If there is one, I don't have access to it just yet. 
Yeah, I want to say the same as well. Did you uh, did you build yours with the speedy speed transmission? Oh yes. <laughs> oh yes. <laughs> Also, let me know when you're at the top, and I'll see if I can come charging up in one try. All right, I'm up. Oh, is this your monstrosity up here? Yeah, that's mine. I figured, because mine is still back in the swamp. I love how it's still yeah, so that, morning in-game. It's beautiful. Yeah, that charge up the hill backfired. Oh, did it? Did you just, like, backflip or something? No, I didn't backflip. It was just like, okay, all your momentum goes bye-bye. Ah, yeah, that happens. That happens. I love the detail on the engine, like, when you can actually see it. Also, the radiator is mounted in the back of the bus. Isn't that, like, so sick? Yeah, that's awesome. I'm glad to see you're still hanging out, uh, Thomas Brown. Thank you so much. Um, let's see. Yeah, I'm never sure of who all Pixel Hats for testing. Yeah, I got you on that one. It's no worries, man. Um, True Flash says no mods on Switch, but we have seen some um, some hints that suggest they might come in the future. So hopefully that's a thing at some point later on down the road. What's going on, Ethan? I see you out there in the chat. And hey, let's point see, turn. What's... Levi, what's good? All right, I'm going to follow you this time. Tandem-ish. Okay. So let me know when you're ready. Yeah, I'm going to just start going right now. Okay. Oh, that's right, a good go, launch this time. Go, 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 oh. My launch was not as good. I went a little crooked. I think oh, he went over I me. I saw a shadow. I am it. Whoa. But with that bounce, you pretty much landed exactly where I did. Did you hit the jump in automatic or high? Or, uh, or high? I hit it in automatic. I would suggest doing it in high, personally. I find that you get more distance when you do it in high. Also, well, here comes did your frames just, like, absolutely ruin Tank. themselves? Yeah, my frames tanked bad. I don't know what also, here just comes happened. Monstrosity, by the way. Oh, okay. Yeah, okay, my frames are fine now. I don't know what the heck just happened to my frames, but jeez. All right, there goes Monstrosity. Monstrosarino. Oh, he Boing. lands on the road. Well, you outflew me. Let's see, three yeah, buses I think is a I lot got of polys. That's fair. Right, stay in monstrosity. I want to hit one more run in the bus, and I think I can. I think I can outdo it if I do it just right. Suspension's going back up. All right, cool. All right, now let's see. I think I can outdo that monstrosity run. What's wrong with the front strut? Yeah, um, sounds good. I think it just was something that glitched out, according to Limes. Um, but he should have it fixed in a in an upcoming update. It's like a weird bend on one of the suspension options. Red, only two mil ish. Ow! <laughs> Ow! What? Two million polys. Oh yeah. That's uh. Ouch. I love how I was able to get up this before, and then now it's like, nah, I'm good. Okay, there we go. I just had to, like, point it straight ahead, and then eventually it started getting grip. I love how I love how Red asks about the strut, and Limes just goes, I don't want to talk about it. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like that kind of be my response as well, but let's see. Wait, what? Um... Lorson, this bus is not PC only. This bus is going to be coming to consoles as soon as it's done, okay? Thank you so much, Rich. I appreciate it. Yep, exactly, Matthew. Exactly. All right, here we go again. I'm trying to beat that monstrosity. So my is still running. Is it still running? That's amazing. Yep. All right, there's full send. I don't okay. know. Okay, that was some frame lag. I don't know if we're going to one... beat it. Yeah, no, actually, that wasn't that wasn't good. That I actually hit your bus, tumbled and high. Hello. I mean, with a little bit of a bounce and a tumble, I was able to get pretty dang close, actually. Um, closer than I would have expected to get, if I'm, like, being completely honest on that one. Yep. You know, though, in terms of stuff that makes me genuinely curious, I wonder... In terms of, like, bodies of water that these things could forward, like Monstrosity and the Megabus, there are... Yeah. You should take that truck to Lime's Playground. We're definitely planning on doing that, but I also wonder about some campaign maps and some of the, like, 
um, some of the craziest, like, bodies of water. Like, like the Yukon River, for example. Yeah. Now, I do want to see, because see, we were going to go, we were going to go to Imandra, but, like, Imantra, Imantra, Imantra kind of got mixed because of the, uh, the, because of the fact that it didn't, um, didn't really work. But I tell you what, Frog, here's, um, here's my plan. We're going to take these to Lime's Playground for the jump of their lifetime, and then we're going to head to Desert Proving Ground Stage 1, hit up some trails in the new Ford, and uh, I think that'll be a good lineup. You ready for that, Diesel? Oh, yeah. All right. Time to hit it. So, y'all, make sure you stick around for the, the, the absolute yeetage and sendage on Lime's Playground, and then after that, we're going to head out for some realistic trail riding in some, um, and actually, it's a pretty realistic trail rigs as well. I like the four-inch lift, lol. Why not end the stream on the mega jump? I mean, we could, but I feel like I feel like I like ending the stream on a, on like a chill note, and trailing is a lot more chill. So, and also we never know what might happen when we go to the mega jump, and I kind of want to leave a little bit of open room for uh, for us to explore some other uh, explore some interesting scenarios that may or may not come up. You know what I mean? That would be like a way better oh, ending. Yeah. Well, to be fair. We don't know how this is gonna go, and so that's why I'm leaving a little bit of a little bit of extra, little bit of extra room for it, rather than making it the actual like ending. But I like, uh, like I said, I like uh, leaving some room for stuff like this, and then ending on a chill note for sure. But let's see, Josh Shadow with that 199 super chat, thank you so much. The bus was like that will be a ten was like that will be a ten minute wait. Yeah, just about. All right, sell, 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 sell. Sounds good to me. All right, back to the main menu, firing it up. And 622M versus Monster Max, happening. Happening, happening, happening. Um, let me make sure I have the 622M on, actually. I should. I don't see any reason why I wouldn't have it on. Oh, there it is. Now it's on. All right. Wait, not new game. Start co-op, Lime's Playground, create, private, go. You know what we're actually going to have to do as well? We're going to have to use the uh, the trailer okay. hitch setup to uh, to haul a bunch of other vehicles to the Mega Jump and just send them. <laughs> yeah, I'm probably going to skip because trailers seem to hate me in this game. That's fair. Oh, that's an idea, Frog. That could that could be a really fun video, honestly. That would be, like honestly, that would be genuinely super fun. Beans rides the bus everywhere. Yeah, pretty much. What the heck is the 622M? Um, it's a beta of a monster truck project by Puppy Master, actually. And let's see. Alejandro, what's good? I see you out there in the chat. Is that Lime's uh, truck in the thumbnail? That's actually yeah, Buddy's truck in the thumbnail in front of the bus. We're going to bring that out a little bit later. Well, we're going to bring out Frog's version, and we have a, then we have a couple of videos uh, coming really, really soon with yeah, Buddy's version. So let's see. I can't wait to see a mod that just eats main for breakfast. Uh, the Megabus. The Megabus. You should trail in the second Pretty gen. Much. I got the flex dialed right in. Oh, definitely. Just remember to bring a regular pickup for size comparison. Oh, for sure. Y'all are creeping up on that 500 legs mark on the stream. Thank y'all so much. Need some fun map ideas? Uh, just one, please. Um, TNB Trails, Desert Proving Ground Stage 1, Desert Trails. All of those are going to be a blast. Now, if you want something a little bit more jump-oriented, Lime's Playground. Um, also, TNB Trails has a big jump as well, as you guys were seeing earlier on the stream. But yeah, I mean, is this on console now? Um, the... So Dubs, Second Gen, and the Mega Bus will be on consoles soon. They're not there yet, but they will be on soon. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and buy a Mega Truck. Or not a Mega Truck, a Mega Bus, since I just got here. And tuned, speedy speed boy. And let's see. No damage toe. Um, and let's see. Biggest T1s that I can buy. She's freaking out. Take the rack off and... I'm going full school bus spec on this one. Hey. Sometimes I just prefer to leave it full school bus spec. It's just cooler that way. You know what I mean? Oh, I oh, said yeah. it to public. I said all of my betas to public. I have a million IRL things going on uh, on top of trying to take a small break from modding. Seemed unfair to leave all of my projects hidden. Hey, you know what? Oh, that's all good. That's all good. So never mind. 622M is public, not a private beta. Never mind. I was confused there for a minute. All right. So while you... Get that ready. I may drop another one before Christmas as a gift to the community, but we'll see. Hey, heck yeah, man. I'm always on board with that. Let's give this thing a quick run through some of the mud. I love how... Okay, yeah, that's the ignore mud. 
That's just the, about ignore water everything. As well, yeah, or as well, as while as well. Um, what about? Oh God! Once you're once you're done building yours, and we're on our way to the mega jump, we gotta hit the backflip ramp to see what happens. Yes. Holy smokes! All right, I'm gonna hit the like you know wild over the top mud pits out here because I want to see if I can swap this thing. I don't even know if it's possible. Let's see. Oh, thank you so much, Mason. It's easy. Wow. Oh, oh, it slowed it down. Didn't swamp it yet, but it certainly slowed it down. That's really, like, exceptional because, because this swamps out, like, a bunch of Lime's other trucks. Like, um, like the freaking 170400 swamps it out completely. I mean, it swamps out some really capable trucks. This, not a chance. That bus coming to consoles? Heck yeah, it is. As soon as Lime's is done, um done building it it will be uh getting sent to the devs for approval and then getting tested and making its way to consoles yeah dude nothing swamps this out nothing nothing i love that i absolutely love that that is that is amazing that is amazing it's impossible to swamp it it's literally impossible to swamp it have you left the garage yet uh no currently building all my trucks Oh, okay. I'm gonna let my uh, my bus chill out here. I actually gave it the um, the towing suspension because I wanted it to have like a lot of um, compression resistance so that when we hit the bottom of the ramp, it won't bottom out. Okay, sounds good. All right, let's see. The bus strosity, yeah, pretty much. Is that bus donation access? Nope, Jake, this is a work in progress of an upcoming not only public mod but a um console friendly public mod so make sure you stay tuned for more on this coming very 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 soon now i'm gonna go build the console friendly um second gen by dubs as soon as i get a little bit of stream hydration bro i freaking needed that i needed that so bad all right, where is the... Oh, it's literally right there. Grizzly 3500, let's fire you up. I don't think this thing has ever been off that big jump. So we'll do the highway, high-range transmission, 6-inch lift hauling, and 44-inch um, KO2s. And let's throw, I don't know, like offline winch, power lockers, no worries there. Uh, RA front and rear bumper, and stack exhaust. Do tinted back glass and tinted uh, rolled-down windows. Don't need the snorkel out. Well, eh, uh, don't need the snorkel out here. I'm, I'm not worried about that. And don't need the dually fenders. And we don't need the box, but we're going to leave that wheel on. We'll paint this one red. I haven't actually... I've never run one of these in red before. Let's see. TC, I like the Christmas semi-trailer. Bro, that thing is sick. The CTFT uh, holiday pack. It's so good. Oh, dude, me too, Kazuki SU. Me too. I can't wait for y'all to get your hands on it. You know, honestly, the six-inch um, hauling lift actually still flexes out pretty freaking well. I mean, look at that. That's your tow suspension. That's really good. For, like, a tow suspension, that is, that's pretty amazing. Tow mirrors be out. Heck yeah, they do. Heck yeah, they do be out. All right, let me back you up real quick and set you right there. Man, you must be building a lot of trucks. Pretty much. I'm going to also build myself a monstrosity because I kind of want to have a monstrosity off. <laughs> um, ooh, I yeah, got to build a monster max too as well. Let's see. Nope. Dual dominators fast. Crane axle, no damage. Largest tires I can fit. And bed LBZ. And should I leave it on the standard color or should I change it up this time? I feel like I always leave it on the standard color. So this time I'm going to change it up. Go for something a little bit more unique. Um... Yeah, that sounds like a good idea. Not that Monster Max 2 in itself isn't unique because, I mean, it, like, how could it not be? But, like, how about a Pretty dark much. green? I actually kind of dig that. Is that bad? I actually really dig that. Drive up to the bus. Oh, yeah, in the freaking uh, second gen, I need to. Actually, I need to drive, uh, drive up to the bus in Monster Max 2. Look at that size comparison between Monster Max 2 and the bus that is that's insanity like i don't even know i don't even know where that would be like i don't even know how you could get to that level in real life 
Because, like, you know, we've all seen, or most likely we've all seen, you know, Whistling Diesel's videos with, you know, Monster Max 2 driving around in real life. And you know how... I forgot to delete the customization presets. Oof. I kind of like the fact that they're there. I mean, I like having the realistic color. But at the same time, it's nice to kind of mess with the other options. So look at the size comparison. Second gen, Monster Max 2, Megabus. So freaking ridiculous. It looks like Monstrosity versus Monster Max 1. Yeah, exactly. Drive onto the frame. Need to do that. Need to hit that. Oh, God. Are you gonna... Oh, I was gonna say, please tell me you're gonna park next to the building and then drive trucks onto the rack. That's a good idea, actually. Drove right under the, the Mega Bus. Right the heck under it. Beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. Love it. Gavin says, arrived late, but what in the name of God is that? Um, that is the, uh, the Megabus by Limes, and it is, uh, coming to a console near you as soon as he is finished developing it, and then, of course, as soon as it gets approved by the developers. Let's see, line up all the games, huge truck side by side, it would look like an actual staircase. It just about would. It really, truly would. All right, let me build one it's more too thing. tall. Oh, is it too tall? Yep, especially the way I have it set up. It's too tall to... Uh, get any vehicles on the roof. Oh, that's annoying. Okay, so I am bringing out a... <laughs> oh, my God. I'm bringing out a... Well, let's just say it is a bit of a... I don't know. A bit of a remote-controlled menace of a vehicle. And <coughs> when I say a bit of a remote-controlled menace, I mean essentially a RC... Firebird, although, why is this RC Firebird, um, why, why is it, like, real vehicle size? What the heck? I think one is real vehicle size, and the other one is, like, regular RC size. Oh. I can see the bus from over here, by the way. Where are you at? Up on the roof of the, well, not the roof, but up on the top of the Mega Jump. Are you already over there? Oh, God. All yep. right, I'm driving my Mega Bus over there, then. Are you bringing the... Oh, you brought out the 450. Heck yeah, that thing is sick. That oh, yeah. That thing is so good. Yeah, I love how Frog says RC. Yeah, in quotation marks. Oh, crud. You should have known by the tire size. Yeah, I know, I know. But, like, it looked it looked kind of weird in the garage, and then I realized as the second I started driving it that, like, oh, something wrong here. Right, goodbye, a treat. Boink. <laughs> yeah, I ain't making it through there. Uh, I'm gonna have to mow over some trees. Hang on. Excuse me. I'm just gonna, like, foghorn the trees real quick. Now, let's see, what are the new console mods? Well, uh, Jesse, if you want to check out the most up-to-date list of the uh, of the mods that are on console right now, we have a link to that that is pinned at the top of the chat. And if you want to know what mods are coming to console soon, this is going to be on console as soon as uh, Limes finishes developing it, and then, of course, the devs test it and approve it. And then also, Dub's second gen called the Grizzly 3500 will be on consoles very, very soon as well, most likely next week. Now, switching back into my Mega Bus, I need to get it up to the top of the jump but before i do that i'm gonna attempt the backflip ramp you broke the sign i know i know maximo what's going on dude all right let me see am i in high mode no all right let me see is this even gonna be possible uh probably not but i'm gonna attempt it anyway one way to blow your transmission high range Oh, boink. Okay. Um, I mean, we kind of did a weird, like, 180 flip. I mean, it kind of looked good from back here. Oh, you were watching that? <laughs> well, I just got to see the back end hey, of that. Power wagon. Or the back end of that. It's power wagon time. Let's Rats. see. Come oh. put that tray over. Oh, what's going on, dude? I see saying hi out there in the chat. Jake says, that won't work. And I'm like, you think? You think? Let's see. Monster Max is not so monster now. Yeah, right? Watch Whistling Diesel build a monster bus now. I know, exactly. Bro, I had to slam on the brakes so hard. Now Limes has to make a bigger backflip ramp. <laughs> it's a good point, actually. It, it is a good point. It's a wonderful point. All right, this guy is going to get staged right here. 
Can I chill? Oh, I thought you were dumping it now. Oh, I can. Um, I would be happy to. D yeah. I mean, I think we're going to wind up taking up so much space with everything else we brought out here to jump. We might as well, yeah. Yep. So one of us is going to have to take the big one, and one of us is going to have to take the middle one, because we can't share a lane, unlike basically anything else <laughs> in the drive. Like, literally, we cannot yeah, share a lane. I'm, I'll take the middle since I'm sitting here now, and it's like trying to move these things around is like trying to parallel park an ocean liner. Yeah, just about. Well, three, two, one, let's send them. Go! <laughs> Holy Am I going to get a front flip out of this? I, I might I get did. two. You're going to get a double front flip? I got like, well, one and a half front flips and landed on my my lid. We're both right side up. Oh, that's amazing. That's amazing. Wow. <laughs> oh, that's Honestly, amazing. Honestly, I was going to jump the app East Tundra, but it's just, it looks too good. Isn't it gorgeous? Like, genuinely, it's so beautiful. Like, the detail on that thing? Mega. Absolutely mega. Although I do need to jump Lime second gen. That needs to be a thing. So let's see. Toe setup. And I'm going to have some thick 52-inch boggers on the thing. And I'm going to throw, well, eh, we'll do the tip. And then, uh, let's see, the cowl hood. We'll do the bed cover because why not? I mean, eh, like, why the heck not? Blue forces bead locked. And the matching deep blue. Oh, crap. I didn't get beans. Yeah, that's worth an extra 100 feet on the jump at least if you have beans on your dash. Absolutely. What are you sending next? Honestly, I don't know. I'm torn between the Raptor, the F450, or the Power Wagon. Ooh. I mean, I'm in line second gen, so whatever you think would be a good match for that. I think it's so fast. It is. F450? All right, send her, dude. I gotta add interior stuff to the F450 or F250 slash 450. Yeah, I gotcha. Oh god. F2450. Yes, exactly. Yeah. <laughs> thing is so like stupid fast. I love the horn on the bus, bro. I love it too, Riley. It's amazing. I love how B gamers like whose truck is that? I'm like, I literally said whose truck this was. This is Limes. Thing is rolling it all the way up. Oh, you're already here. Okay. Yep. And doing push-ups. <laughs> exactly. Well, uh, you ready? Yep. I'm gonna let you go first. You yeah, go. I think I'm gonna need a bit of a head start. You just might. All right, here I go. I think I almost caught you by the <laughs> by the jump. I'm gonna literally take this on my wheels. Boing. I, I didn't know dive. I had so much rebound from that that, like, I landed on all four wheels and the rebound caused me to flip over. Okay, so last big send, or big vehicle to send. Is it Monstrosity? Yes. <laughs> all right, well, give me a second. I want to send Monster Max 2 uh, in conjunction with your send of Monstrosity. Okay, sounds good. You'll go a lot farther than I will, but, you know. Got another tree. I saw that. I just drove over the one that you flattened. The way you know that the Megabus is so much bigger than Monstrosity is the fact that you were still able to drive under the sign. Yeah, that's a good point, actually. <sighs> Did you see yeah, you my were. suspension get weird right there? I saw it dancing around a bit, yeah. Yeah, it, it gets odd sometimes. I'll take the far lane this time so that you can... Uh, try and get Monster Max 2 to go further. Yeah, that tree does not want to break. I cannot get it to let go of me. Okay, I got it. It just did not want to let go. All right, Whoa, let's I... see. Give her the beans. Yeah, pretty much. It's beans time for real. Dip the tire off there. That was creepy. Hmm? Or scary, I should say. It was like, okay, tire in space. Oh, did you literally almost get launched? Let's see. Yeah. I 
All right, Matthew Prince, we will see you next time. Thank you so much for hanging out and talking with us on the stream. Oh, boy. All right, did you say you want me, wanted me to go first or at the same time? At the same time, but you get that lane. Okay, fair. Three, two, one, go. Actually, I just had an idea. You go ahead. Don't worry. I know what I'm doing. I'm a professional. He knows what he's doing. He's a professional. Yeet. I went with, like, a neutral jump, but... Oh, I actually hit your F450. Uh... Look I'm back here. on my wheels. Holy crap! Well, apparently the monstrosity still goes way further out here than the monster bus does. <laughs> Let's see. RS1 rides. Look at my last comment. Uh, uh. Hold on. Wait. Let's see. Whose truck is on the? Oh, whose truck is in the thumbnail? The the so the monster bus is Limes, and then the Ford in front of the monster bus. That is actually Yeah Buddies. Ford F450 slash F250. It's a collaboration between Frog and Yeah Buddy. But um, that truck, we have Frogs on right now. And then Yeah Buddies, I will show you guys uh, soon in an upcoming video. Because that thing is so sick. Like, I mean, they're both insane, really. I have videos on both trucks coming really soon. All right, let's see. Actually, can I drive Monster Max 2 under the Megabus? I don't know. I mean, you should be able to. That is if I can fit it between the tires. Hang on. Uh, oh, the, the game doesn't like this. Somehow I'm not surprised, actually. Oh, nope, it, it, it happens. It works. It's under the Megabus. It's actually under the Megabus, successfully. Drove it under. Wow. Storms, what's good out there in the chat? I see you saying hi. And let's see. Um, let's see. TC, I need help. I'm on console, and in the mod section, I can only turn on one or two. How can I fix it? Um, That is currently a... That's currently just kind of the the state of the update. Um, the update apparently lowered the amount of RAM that the game would distribute to mods because of the uh, amount of RAM that the new DLC takes up. But I hope that they bump it back up just a little bit because I feel like it was a little bit too much that they uh, that they lowered the RAM capacity there. But um, that is currently just like the state of the update. But um, hopefully they uh, they rework that uh, a little bit later on in the future. What did I do? wait? What did I just walk in on? Ah, uh, uh, you'll want to hang around and find out, Jonah. You will absolutely want to hang around and find out. All right, so let's see. TC, I have a question. What's up, Storms? What is good? All right, where are you at, Diesel? I'm at the top of the ramp, and Ew. I don't know if you want to jump the Raptor, and I jump the power wagon. Oh, totally. We totally right. can. Ah, uh, wait. Push the suspension up. Same lane. Yeah, same lane. Are those buses a console mod? They will be coming to console as soon as Limes uh, finishes developing them. And then, of course, once they get approved by the developers. But yes, they are console friendly. All right. Okay. Three, two, one. Let's go. All right, neutral. Yeah, you have more gearing than I do. I just had to put it in neutral and gravity run it. Bro, the way this thing, like, sits back it, with the weight. Boing. Oh, God, that was a massive boing. It's still, <laughs> it's still rolling. I am okay. I'm good. You know the funny thing? The What's way that? that was sitting, it looked like one of those teddy bears. I know, right? It's, <laughs> it's like, probably because of the way the wheelbase is just set up. Dude, y'all just yep. blew through that 500 likes mark of the stream. Thank y'all so much. We genuinely appreciate it. All right. Well, now that we've gotten a uh, a massive, massive amount of heatage done out here, we're going to make a quick switch out to um, Desert Proving Ground Stage 1 because we have some really interesting stuff in store. And Diesel, I think we're going to make a switch now to uh, Game VC from the Private VC. Okay, sounds good. Hmm. I just need to fire up a new instance of... Um, of uh, Desert Proving Ground Stage 1. Let's see. Can you consider a game to revisit and play again? Ooh, that's an interesting question. Real quick, I'm going to do a little bit of a Discord channel swap. So we're going to pop out of that VC real quick. And we're going to pop into a different VC. But let's see. All right. Hello. We should be good to go. Hello there. I think we've got everybody. All right, so let's go custom scenarios and Desert Proving Grounds stage one. Delete Limes Playground and load into Desert Proving Grounds. Oh, Desert Trails. Oh, not Desert Proving Grounds, Desert Trails. Never mind. Oof. Okay. 
Uh, let's see. I think I have Desert Trails. I'm pretty sure I have it. I just don't have it on. So I'm going to need to go back to my browser, turn it on, and then jump into it. It also has another Mega Jump, which I know we're obviously going out here to do trailing, but I'm probably going to, like, you know, have a, <laughs> a cheeky send oh, in, yeah, the, I have in the bus. Trails. Yeah, I was going to say, you probably do. Or you should. Um, yep. I'm going to have to do at least one cheeky send in the bus. Would you ever revisit No Limit Drag Racing 2.0? Um, definitely. Like, I'm I, um, definitely not opposed to revisiting that at some point later on down the road. Okay, so I'm on the wrong map right now. And uh, let's see. Frog said he was going to host it, I think. So let's see. Okay. Or I can host. I mean, I have, no, I have nothing against hosting. And I'll just go ahead and host it. I, I can host. Oh, okay. I had to go to the bathroom real quick. Oh, no, you're good. Um, That's weird. Uh, It said I didn't have Desert Trails, like, subscribed. But then I searched it, and it said, oh, do you want to turn it on? And I'm like, yeah, but I – Desert Proving Grounds and then Desert Trails, the public work in progress, right? Uh, I think that's the one I have. The one with, like, 5,700, uh, like, uh, uh, I, subscribers? I got it. I gotta check. Okay. I just I just launched SnowRunner. Oh, okay. Yeah, driving to the garage now. On that one. Mod browser is. Yeah, fifty-seven hundred subscribers. Yeah. Okay. That's public one. Yeah. Okay. All right, that'll be the one. Now let's see. Yeah. Um. Oh, I hope. Oh wait, what? Are you ever going to use the TUZ420 again? Um, oh, you got a chance to ride in one? That's so sick. That's wild. Um, Aaron, Greg, do you know why the monstrosity was removed from console? Uh, supposedly it was because there was, like, some badging on it. It's it's literally called an OBS forward. Oh, is that what the file is called? Well, like, on mod.io, it's monstrosity 20 whatever door OBS, OBS. forward. Oh. <laughs> At the moment, I don't have Frog in my friends list. <laughs> Oh, LOL. wow. Um, okay. Well, uh, me, and the Grizzly uh, is downloading an update. I was going to activate that one. So. Well, be, if that's the case, then I can go ahead and just fire up um, the Desert Trails. I got you guys. Um, All right. Um, well, just do just do the F-250. Okay. Uh, you can turn on, like, the Power Wagon if you want it on. Okay. And, let's and then, see. like, the Grizzly in the map. That way, there's no mod conflicts or anything that's fair okay and let's see uh do you know if the 7.3 is coming back to console i i hope so i i really truly hope so because red did re did release an updated version of it um i don't know if they will test it or not i hope they do um but we can only cross our fingers and hope for the best all right so loading in and i'm gonna just go ahead and like well, I guess... No, it won't let me recover yet. All right, well, let me drive over to the garage. I'll get our garage situation all uh, solidified and everything. And then... Um, all right. Okay. I kind of wish this map had, like, a little garage button right on spawn, but it's not a thing. Yeah, it would be nice. It's not like it's far, though. It's not like... I mean, I'm not going to sit here and complain yeah. that it's too far. <laughs> Yeah, I mean, the only thing I would really complain about with all of this is just throw car. That <laughs> That's literally my only complaint. Yeah, oh, as the starter? Yeah. Yeah. All right, main menu. I got that retained, and I'm going to go ahead and... um. Wait, oh, God. All right, let's see. I'm not going to get yeeted, and then you get yeeted. Yeah, that happens. Um. Oh, Limes, I don't know if... Uh, well, I don't know, Frog, if you read the chat, but Limes wants you to DM him. <laughs> Uh, da, 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 da. All right, okay. let's see. see. What did when did Limes last even message me? Jeez. <laughs> um, we have. So let me turn off the Juggernaut, and I'm gonna turn off like everything that I've got on except for the stuff that we need on. Um, so let's see. Yeah. Here and here, 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 here. Uh, I don't want to turn off the Mega Bus. I feel so bad. All right. <laughs> <laughs> Okay. This is a trail ride, not a yeet session. <laughs> it, it, is it? Are you sure about that? Yes. I mean, I'm sure. I can. I can chuck anything. <laughs> um, Red's trailers, or don't worry about them. Uh, you can. Okay. I mean, you but probably you have. Know, them. You know how the whole 
freaking it just detaches anything you pack to a trailer. Oh, that's fair. So I won't even worry about those then. Um, got that all on. Yeah, the best thing about those is the uh, like they'll just desync and all of a sudden move. Uh, yeah, that's that is indeed true. Turn those off, and then got that. Uh, don't need to worry about that. Got that, and then I think I'm well. I'll turn that off. I think I'm good. All right, so the maps don't really matter. I have other maps on, but they don't really matter. Um, I've got yeah that, that. Yeah, I mean power wagon and forward pretty much. We good there. All right. Yeah, it's just basically power wagon and Ford. All right, so let's see. I made it. Hey, what's up, dude? Thank you for stopping by. I hope you all. Uh... Mm -hmm. All right, work up, idiot. We will see you. See you out here uh, back in the stream soon. And let's see. Is the GWC uh, like semi trucks out for console? Not yet, but they should be out within the next like few days. Uh, those trucks usually don't have any trouble at all making it to console. Um, will Snowrunner ever come to phones? Well, they tried that with mm -hmm. Mud Runner, and. Um, well, it it, but, it it didn't work out very well. <laughs> and they brought it on Switch. I guess that's the closest you're going to get to mobile. Pretty I much. mean, that's fair. Yeah. Unless you have that wild, like... I don't know if either of y'all saw that video of um, that crazy, like... It's like a $1,200 or $1,500, like, handheld gaming PC. No. Yeah, the Steam something or other. Yeah, there's videos of, like, people playing Horizon 5 on it, and I'm like, man, if that thing plays Horizon 5, you could technically, you could have a mobile, handheld, PC-modded version of SnowRunner if you really wanted to pay, like, $1,500 for a handheld gaming PC. Yeah, that's gonna be a big nope from me. I mean, I like my games, just not that much. Oh, crap, I just realized something. Hold on, I gotta back out. Um, oh. I have... I had one literally of, as I loaded in. I had well, one. Of, I, had I one can of. just start it now. Then I suppose. Well, somehow I mean, it says I have one of one of BB's trucks on, but I actually don't. Well then, like it literally, it was in. Uh oh, I have the Raptor on as well. What, how? And the Punisher and the whoa and the Tundra. What the heck? Bunch of stuff I don't have turned on. Or well, even but the downloaded, thing is, I should say. <laughs> so I set it to subscribe mods only and enabled mods only, and it didn't show those to me. Oh, now it does. Now now you show me all these other mods. Well, I, I'm about to unlock the garage in single player, and I can just start it. And well, we know I'm, there won't be anything extra. <laughs> yeah, I need to, I need to know that. how to get to the um how to get to your uh to the overlay to find your name. Uh, what do you mean? The epic overlay. Oh, like, I, mean, I still haven't epic, figured uh, out that epic overlay. I yeah. Just, you know, I just people just join sessions these days and it works fine. <laughs> I mean, I guess. Let's see. Start co-op. Well, hold on. All right. Desert Trails. Join a friend's game. Okay. Yeah, I'm setting it up now. Oh, you're setting it up? Okay. Um... So let me actually, let me go through my mods list just a little bit more and see if there's any, like, weird straggler mods that are still on. Um, and let's see. What's well, good, Thomas? Oh, welcome back. Ours one rides. Um, oh, dude, you too. I hope you have a really good holiday season. Um, the bus isn't on consoles yet. Well, not yet, but as soon as it's done, and um, as soon as it's done, it's going to get tested. And I'm sure it'll get approved pretty quick. Yeah, there's really nothing that would hold it back from getting approved. I mean, it's literally you know, super low RAM usage, and it's designed from the ground up to be used on console. So I don't really see any issue with it getting approved really freaking fast. Now, once you got that uh, that session set up, we'll be able to jump in there and y'all will be yeah. able to take a look at this freaking Ford. The Ford is yeah. just, oh, it's top notch. It's next level. It's top notch. There's like, there's not yeah, much that I'm, can rival that thing. I'm in the garage. Oh, you're ready? All right. Yeah. Well, are you in the garage in park. MP or single player? In, in multiplayer, okay. yeah. All right. Desert trails. And I accepted your request, Diesel. Yeah, I just saw that, actually, so I joined. Should be joining you pretty quick. Um, right. Diesel, are you loading it up from the in-game friends list? Yeah, oh, from and... the in-game friends list. Um, I'm joining off of Diesel. Apparently, I I thought I had fraud. Uh, you do. 
I just had a weird situation here. What's that? Oh. It kicked me back to the main menu after saying I completed the session. So I'm going to try that again. Uh, That's weird. Um. Oh, wow. It said, uh, it said you had a mod that I didn't have. <laughs> Wait, what? It was the, um. Oh. Like a ZIKZ off road, but it oh, was. Oh, did you not? Oh, it was okay, zero hold megs. On, hold on. It was zero megs, so I downloaded yeah, but it immediately. That's, I thought we all had the power wagon in that mod. Oh. Here, here I'll just go turn it off. It's that fine. ain't where my power wagon is. Uh, I remember uh, Diesel sending us that to put the power wagon in, so that's what <laughs> I chose. Oof. Let's see. <laughs> Kelby says, what are the two mods on the thumbnail? Well, one of them is Lime's Oof. new Megabus, which is coming to consoles. That thing is going to be sick. And the other one is a collaborative Ford F-250 slash F-450 project between uh, Frog and yeah, buddy. So more videos are coming soon on info about those trucks. So, yeah, let me know when you've got another game up, and I'll just go back to yeah, it. Yeah, I went ahead and restarted my whole game just to make sure oh, it oh, okay. loads in fine. So you guys can see that Megabus that I'm talking about. This is it right here. You can't really see much of it on that, like, thumbnail picture. But let's see. Tell Forg to turn on the I, second gen. I haven't even downloaded it yet. So I'm just going to go trailing. <laughs> it ain't that big. It's only, like, like 178 megs. Uh, da, 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 okay. I mean, go hey, what's up, Eli? Thanks so much for stopping in. First live? Oh, that's awesome, bro. Thank you so much. Should do a tug of war with the F-250? I mean, if the physics mm. allowed for it, we would do one. But the physics don't really like tug of war. You know what I mean? So it's kind of a weird, like, in-between on that one. You could do them in Mudrunner, though. But yeah, let me know when you're uh, you're good to go over there. I'm going to... Oh, I gotta download the second gen now. Okay. As you do that, I'm gonna head into Proving Grounds real quick and uh, experiment with something on the Megabus. <laughs> um, but then just let me know when you're uh, when you're ready, and I'll just back out. I'll head to the um, I'll head to the multiplayer, and then we'll both be able to join off of you real quick. All right. All so right. Let me experiment yep. with this thing real quick. So. I want to see if I, so if I throw a crane on here, I said, okay, handbrake on. Now, if I throw the crane on this thing, that's good. Then I'll throw, I don't know, um, let's see. Um, we'll throw maybe like just the full size super duty. That's fine. Now. I'm going to use the Mega Bus to put the Super oh, Duty on top uh, of the... What's up? I don't have crane sockets. <laughs> oh, okay. Well... Uh, I'll, I'll add those before I finalize the mod for you. <laughs> okay. I just figured I was going to lift it on top of the garage and then just put it there. <laughs> I mean, if it, a winch would work for it, then go ahead. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <The> crane sockets. <laughs> I guess I'm going to... I'll tell you what. I'll do the... Um, I'll do this in like, cause I don't have, I'm not going to be on here for, uh, or on the, um, the testing grounds for a lo super long time. So I'll do it with like a default truck. All def mods default are boy. done. Oh, heck yeah. All right. So let me put you on top of the garage building, uh, with the water crossing suspension. Oh, good grief. <laughs> That's awesome. Scarlet beans. Um, something on this is not happy because it won't allow me to lift it. Like the crane is like, no. You cannot lift the ZIKZ. It is like an absolute no for me. Maybe it's because the engine is like away from me. I guess that's the case. All right, are you in multiplayer? Yeah, I'm in multiplayer. All right, I'm going back to the main menu. And I don't think I have to turn the bus off because you just don't have it on. So start co-op. Yeah, I didn't turn it on. All right, join friends. And Diesel, are you already like loading into that one? Yeah, currently loading in. All right, my friends list is loading. Although it's not going to show me Frog because we've determined now that it doesn't show. Um... Yeah, so Diesel Addict. Um... Really weird, though. Yeah, Frog <laughs> is not a thing on my friends list. Uh, Diesel, you're apparently now in that game because I can join off of you, though. Yeah, let's see if that breaks my game or not, though. Okay, well, I'm well, joining I'd now. Well, I wait until he's totally loaded. Oh, there we in, go. But... 
Well, did too late on that one, it, Frog. It, you know, it's whatever. Connecting to a session with mods, <laughs> proceed, yes. Let's see. It's so weird. I never, like, join off of, um, let's see. Oh, yeah, no worries, Storms. No worries at all. Oh, I never join off of other people, so we'll see if this works. Oh, I got a, um, I got the title screen and the map name, so I should be okay. Yeah, so she joined. Let's see. TC, please tell everyone if the second gen is on console or not. Uh, it's not, uh, Dub's second gen is not on console yet, but it will be um, probably at the beginning of next week. He's releasing it on mod.io on Friday, most likely, but um, it's obviously got to go through testing and all that, so it'll be there soon. Um, so let's see. So I'm in, and there's uh, actually the Grizzly is there, and the, oh, Lime second gen is there, and the uh, full-size invasion Super Duty is here. God, this thing is so nice. Ugh. I can't wait for you guys oh, to see my full video on this thing. It's so good. It's like, it's such an absolute monster of a truck. All right, so Patagonias are going on this thing with a nice set of, let's see, 250 badges. And we're doing the, um, let's see, the custom front bumper. I like the tube bumper, but I haven't really run the custom at all. So I'm going to run the, um, the custom one this time. We'll do, eh, we'll do like white rock lights. Nothing too crazy. And let's see, tube rear bumper for sure. Grill is going to be a uh, blacked out grill. Headlights will be, I don't know, purple. The purple looks really good. I'm going to remove the Vicowl because, I mean, I'm not the biggest fan of the Vicowls, but like, it's kind of one of those like personal preference things. And super duty tailgate. Cut fenders in the back for sure. Axle dump exhaust. And I like it with the bed cap. The bed cap is so, like, unique looking on this thing. Um, I'm going to run some... Yeah, these look really good. They're, like, kind of steely style wheels. They look sick, by the way, with the um, the Patagonias on them. I love oh. these colors. All I've been running is the steelies on here. That and <laughs> the AEV style wheels. Like, oh my god. First live? That's awesome, Ethan. Thank you so much. Hope you're really enjoying it. All right, let me find a good... I like a little bit of a lighter gray. All right, let's fire this thing up. And this thing runs so, like, smooth. I love how you're... Both of y'all are in, like, the full IFS one, and I'm I'm just in the stock one over here. <laughs> I ain't IFS. Things, like, solidly... Oh, you mean... Not full IFS, full leaf, my bad. Oh, I think in your uh, mind, you probably had the, like, full-size invasion acronym in your head, but, like... Yeah, <laughs> yeah, I'm pretty sure that's what it was. <laughs> uh, you're good. Are you... Are you, I mean, hey, are you hitting yeah, trails in the stock bullies. one? Oh, yeah. Dude, this is all I've been trailing with is a stock one lately. That's sick. All right, I'll let y'all go in front. I love this thing with the cap. I know a lot of people aren't, like, the biggest fan of caps on trucks like this, but I think the cap looks so good. Peyton YT OG was good. Oh my god. BMP production says tell Frog to stream. I'm like, I can't tell I Frog. Wanna. I'm like, I can't tell Frog what to do. Frog and I learned this a long time ago, but Frog does what Frog wants, okay? <laughs> you know? Okay. I love SnowRunner when it likes to act up with my audio. Is it acting up with your audio? <laughs> yeah, I, I'm gonna have to like just turn my audio volume off for the game because every time I touch a bush, it's like at a hundred percent volume, but my truck sound is like at twenty five percent. I've never had that happen. Warcraft eighty eight, welcome back. And let's see, Cummins guy, what's good out there in the chat? And EH Productions, one of the latest console mods. Um, you can find those through the pinned link at the top oh. of the chat, and then of course uh, on Friday. Dubs is releasing his uh, console-friendly second gen, and then uh, shortly after that, Limes is going to be pushing out his console-friendly Megabus. What did I miss? Uh, well, a couple of yeets, but now we're doing some uh, some chill trail riding in some realistic uh, Ford F-250s. These things are incredible, by the way. Appreciate it. Yeah, still got to do some tweaks uh, to the rear bed weight. Mm -hmm. So I decided to make the actual bed liner an add-on as well, so you can run, like, no frame. Oh, yeah. Well, I like how the bed liner is a removable add-on. Uh, yeah. Pretty much, Red, yeah. Pretty much. Um, I do have to say, 
But I feel like these Patagonias are probably my favorite tire model in terms of like crawlers to use lately. Yeah, they are pretty nice. Don't with the KM3s. <laughs> hey, and nothing I, wrong with those. I, I got the pit bulls. <laughs> I love how we all chose different tires, although those three are probably, like, the main three that I would run in, like, you know, if this was, like, if I was actually, like, picking tires, if this was the realistic scenario, it would probably be one of those three, or maybe, like, well, does anybody have, for SnowRunner, like, a Maxxis Razor model? I don't think there is a Maxxis Razor model at all. Oh, so, like, nobody's yeah. even made one. Okay. Not yet. Let's see. Bryant, what's guess, good? Thank I'm you for that $3 problem. super chat. Let's see. I want to see you guys yeet a beast. Oh, don't worry. There's a place on this map where we can yeet something a little bit later. We're kind of doing a little bit of a uh, little bit of a mixture between realism and yeeting right now. We're getting some uh, we're getting our realism fix right now, and then we'll yeet something a little bit later. Oh, I dented my tailgate. Dang it. Hi, I got yeah, a I'm... few dents. We're 442 meter things away from the repair shop, though, so it's okay. Yeah, we good. <laughs> <laughs> First time I bapped it on the rock, I was like, well, there's no going back now. I tried to catch so up I with just... Diesel, so I gave it some throttle, and it was like, boop, I'm on the side now, but I'm good. I flopped back over. Yeah, I turned around just in time <laughs> to see that. I'm trying to be, like, like super realistic, apart from the time where I just, like, yeet my throttle to catch up with y'all. It's like, I, it, when I'm trying to be realistic, I find myself going too slow, which I feel like some people would be like, you? Too slow? The hell is wrong with you? Like... Just over here in low three. Yeah, that works low really plus. well. Honestly, I find myself calling them like low three, low two, like back from Mud Runner. Yeah, it's a habit you don't get out of. Yeah, pretty much. I love the look of the axle model on the uh, the full size invasion version. Oh uh, yeah, nice little beefy, whatever axles you want to call them. Well, same I mean, ones I had on the tank cat. Well, they look like, at least in terms of, like, texture-wise, it looks really cool under a new truck like this because it looks like you pulled them out of a junkyard and threw, like, giant springs on them and just welded them on and got, like, custom drive shafts made. And then you were like, yeah, looks good to me. I'm going to send it now. Like, Yeah, that, that was pretty much the, the overall want of how it looks. Yeah, I mean, oh, sorry, Diesel. Yeah, you're fine. Oh, like okay jeez that's a turn oh, <laughs> holy smokes nothing like a little crawl sesh oh i know right let's see whoa late stream just got out of basketball practice how's it going it's going really well dade absolutely kazuki says that ford is next level bro it it, it really truly is i've still got more suspension it's any level uh, yeah i guess technically <laughs> uh, i've still got more uh stuff to add on to it though like a couple more add-ons i've got a surprise add-on i'm putting on here for christmas oh do you really oh that's gonna be yeah. sick it's going to be wild <laughs> is it like like looks or performance uh, or if you want to even hint at that it's purely visual but it's definitely going to affect your performance on a realistic scale oh okay hey void star welcome back thank you so much for that 499 super chat i see you saying yo out there in the chat and let's see Oh, somebody out there in the chat says, hey, Alabama here. <laughs> I love it, though. Hey, I love when people are, like, repping a state out there in the chat. It's so cool. Um, what's up, Nissan Skyline? I see out there in the chat. Oh, dude, you definitely should, Kazuki. Drip, what's good? Get no grip on the dirt. That's weird. Like, these things have really good grip on the rocks, but, like, uh, sometimes really steep dirt, they get kind of iffy. Yeah. Let me get to... Back up a little bit. Have you trailed much on um on uh uh proving ground? Well, desert proving grounds. I found a really fun, uh, like realistic, like Moab style trail out there. Like I was going to, but then Pixel started working on the uh, forest trailing map, and I'm like, ooh, I want to drive it. <laughs> I mean, <laughs> so I get I've that been on that map more than anything. All right, I'm just gonna take an entirely new line here. This is not working out i can back up a bit give you all some space let's see joseph barry what's going on out there in the chat and let's see what's on it too itc oh wait this is a new account because someone stepped on my tablet but we got it fixed hey i'm glad you got it fixed bro i'm glad you got it fixed i like the truck thank you so much sick later and let's see rally racer is like man everybody out here like repping their states in the chat he goes 
He goes, I don't know about y'all, but I'm a Florida man. <laughs> yeah, okay, that makes no sense. Like, on that overlay, there's, like, no traction, but plenty off of it. Okay. That's weird. Let's see. New Zealand out there? Okay, that's sick. Ooh. Oh. All the way, man. All the way. And All let's right. see. Oh, for sure, Oscar. I've actually seen multiple videos about that, and it looks really interesting. I got to dig more into it really soon. Do you want me to give you more room as well, Diesel? Yeah, just a little bit more room. Okay. I'm going to give you just a tad bit, because I feel like you're probably going to need it for this. Um, yep. Got Kate Which out there I'm in the chat says, can probably. I get an Arkansas? Right? All these states out there in the chat. 100 miles. Are you serious? Be right back? Sheesh. South Carolina out there in the chat. Well, rock balancer mode sort of works. Oh, <laughs> did you uh, did you high gear it or something? Yeah, Ooh. high gear. I feel like I like I made it this far. To get back on the trail. I made it this far and I really don't want to like um, I really don't want to go any further backwards because I feel like if I let myself roll back, it's going to be bad. Real bad. Let's see. Casey there out there repping. I love it. I love it. Hey, what's up, Rosara7? Welcome back. All right, back oh on boy, the trail again. <laughs> there we go. It, it was very sketchy looking, but I, I made it back with the help of a little bit of a winch. I am going to use this little rock notch right here to try to, like, avoid the dirt. And actually... That worked Wait. really well. That line worked yeah. incredibly. I didn't have to use a winch at all. I'm, I'm not following this trail. I, I see a way better line. <laughs> okay. <laughs> he says, oh, let me back up. Hold on. Uh, that was just gravity took the truck. <laughs> Did he just, like, jump off the <laughs> Hang on. The sun is in my eyes like mad. I need to get up to the top of the trail to see this. I mean, Ooh, what I'm, what I'm doing really is I'm just aiming the camera at the truck yo this is like you want to talk about like next level though like we're pretty much playing full-size invasion the simulator right now <laughs> pretty much actually oh crud i'm high centered ease my way up onto the you're high centered here oh, oh nice winch action i saw that oh, oh crap <laughs> <laughs> hold on let me pass you and then i'll pull you back under your wheels Oh, that's awesome, yeah, Kazuki SU. I might be able to toss a winch line out to a tree, I think. Hold on. I'm a bit high centered, but I'm trying to find it. Nope, oh, got it. Hold on. I was going to say, if not, I could probably get him from back up here. Slightly cheeky winch on that, but it kept me in an area where I was able to keep my angle manageable. All right, Diesel, I'm going to give you a little bit of a winch, unless yeah. Frog's already got you. And uh, oh. I'm, I'm on your truck now. Okay. There yep, we go. Good. Oh. You are flipped back up. All right, here we go. Oh, God. I say, here we go. Not bad. Not, uh-oh. <laughs> God. I almost, like, I almost drove into a scenario that already, like, was going to high center me. But, like, I love that little, like, cut through right there. That's pretty sick. Are you up at the repair area, Frog? Yep. My truck looks good again. <laughs> I can't wait for my visual damage to be fixed. I still need, like, let's see. Oklahoma out there in the chat. Let's see. Cole Jones was good. I see saying hi. And let's see. Enjoy watching you guys do the same, uh, same thing my buddies in Washington State do. Love SnowRunner. Bro, I mean... I love, like, having a balance between, like, full yeet mode and, like, you know, like, a realistic, chill trail session. Love it, dude. These things look so sick. I'm glad I was able to get one with the bed cap. And that way, that way people can kind of see, like, a really good variety of what you can build out of these trucks. Well, the, the really cool thing is we all have the different grills on here. Oh, I didn't even realize that. He, Diesel has body color. <laughs> You have chrome Oops. and I have blacked out. I meant to yeah. go for blacked out, actually. Oops. <laughs> <laughs> hey, I mean, it, it still, it looks sick. It looks really, really good. I also find it funny how you guys are running clean exhaust and I'm here rolling coal to beat the band. Oh, no, I'm the only one running clean exhaust. Yeah, I'm, I'm running, uh, I'm running axle oh, okay. dump, but, uh, but it's, it's, um, it's coal. Okay, I got you. Let's see. I haven't had a chance to yet, Oscar, but I definitely will pretty soon. Um, oh, wow, that's awesome. Saying by 2.0. That's out there. 
Now let's see. Uh, Rose says hopping on Xbox. Gonna drive that Lotus Avaya some more. Good luck with it. Logging a snorter I find so satisfying. I find logging satisfying when it works well, if that makes sense. <laughs> I find it satisfying when it goes right. Yeah, yeah. When it goes <laughs> wrong, it can be bad. <laughs> yeah. yeah. But let's just leave it at two words. No comment. Yeah, there you go. There's there's that. Does this lead to more rocks, Frog? I've never been down this way before. Uh, uh probably everywhere leads to somewhere. I mean, I I, I guess. <laughs> I guess. I mean, I've, I've kind of flown over this area, I think. I've droned twice. out here, but like I haven't um oh, There goes my transmission. Oh. Oh, did you like chuck it in reverse? Yeah, you did. Um Yeah, all I was right. aiming for high. <laughs> All right, young boy fan, we'll see when you get back, buddy. And Kate McCoy, is there any new mods? Um, For the list of the latest mods, check out the link that is pinned at the top of the chat for the latest mods that are on console. And then as far as the latest um, mods that are going to be coming to console soon, uh, Dub Second Gen is coming on Friday, uh, well, at least for release on mod.io. And then the... Mega bus that you guys see in the thumbnail and also that you saw earlier in the stream that one is going to be coming as soon as uh limes is finished developing it and then it'll be sent to the devs you know for approval i not really sent but released on mod.io and then they'll test it and then it'll come out and uh so and so yeah words of wisdom exactly on the everywhere leads to somewhere and just about oscar <laughs> i don't know where we're going everywhere just following frog <laughs> i was gonna say we're, we're just driving man this is this is just trailing uh, it's trail making, pretty much. Let's see. Hey, Any, uh, everywhere's a trail as long as there's no road. I, I, I guess. Let's see. Any new info on the next Offered Outlaws update? Uh, nothing new on that yet, but um, but stay tuned as um, as we get a little bit further uh, further into it and a little bit closer to its release, because I'm sure more info will pop up. I feel like we'll eventually find a trail if we go this way far enough. Uh, you know, this this is my my trail. Okay. <laughs> I mean, there's a factory out here at some point. There's just a lot of nice articulation in the suspension through here. Oh yeah, you can get a little um, you can get kind of like some chase truck ish vibes. Yeah. Did you just hit that tree? No. Uh, I scuffed one of the branches, but I didn't flat out hit it. Okay, on my screen, you hit it head on. Okay. All right, Snow Runner. Let's see. Yep, desync things. Carry MP2 was good. Love the videos. Thank you so much. I really appreciate that. I wonder if we... Wait a minute. I need to check the map and see if we're going a back way to the, uh, the giant jump. Probably not, but... Well... We could... Uh, this, is, this is where the dunes are. It's the other side. Oh, I mean. we're actually, we're actually, we're near no, where the giant jump there, is, though. There is a method to my madness, okay? We always go down the climb that's right by the garage. Yeah. I never climb up it. I don't think I've ever, even in my, in my life of playing this map, I've never climbed up that hill, so. Yeah. So I figured, you know, hey, that would be something nice. We'll go the long way around, you know. I'd love to and do that. I'm super rock down. crawling up it. Yeah, for sure. Now, let's see. Colin was good. I see you saying hi. Cash, I see you saying hi out there as well. And let's see. Vegas here. And uh, when are you bringing back Gigabit? Um, I don't know. Maybe a little bit later on down the road. Uh, let's see. I ran out of Cherry Coke stream hydration. I'm so sorry. Fortunately, I still have half of my coffee left and like half of my water as well. You know, I think TC feels the same way I do when it comes to playing the mobile off-road games. Like... SnowRunner's got some really amazing mods and maps right now that are so much better than anything in a mobile game. I mean... So it's like, I could play an off-road mobile game, or I could just go play SnowRunner. I mean, although yeah. at times when I have... And, and I get it, you know, like when I'm at home. But, like, I mean, if I'm traveling or something and I'm sitting in the airport, I mean, obviously I'm not going to be able to, like, bring my my PC tower with me. So oh, Offered yeah, Outlaws, of Offer Outlaws works great in that scenario. I still think they've done a lot with it for, like, for what it started out as. They've done so much with that game. They really Ooh. have. Oh, crud. Oh, jeez. That was a little <laughs> bit of a nosedive. That wasn't even a nosedive. That was a couple of barrel rolls. Landed oh, did up you, right. Did you crash? I didn't even realize you crashed. Oh. 
I think yep. Diesel is sending it. <laughs> I mean, high gear is there for a reason, Frog. I mean, I'm in high gear dunes. too, but I'm not sending it that much. I'm doing it just enough. <laughs> yeah. I'm in like yeah, auto actually for most of this. Yeah. Really? <laughs> oh, that was a nice jump up up there. I'm going to see if I can get a good looking jump. Let's see. Yeah. With how front heavy it oh, is. Oh, dude. That actually looked sick. A little bit of a drift out of it too. That's awesome. I love well, that. Probably, probably gonna be the last one for me here, guys. So, gonna make it a good one. Send! Oh my <laughs> God! Jesus! All right, Diesel. We will see ya. Enjoyed it. Later. Yeah, man. Peace out. All right, Frog. I uh, before I oh there he goes. Um, before I uh, before oh God, I'm getting the connection warning. That's probably because Diesel oh. backed out though. Yeah, maybe. But um. Uh, the last the last part of this for me is gonna be this climb up because after that I do have to actually I do have to actually end the stream, but um, I really do want to see how this climb goes. Oh yeah, should be a nice one. Do you run low like uh, low two or low three for this? Uh, I'm in low three at the moment, but right here with this build I'm gonna need a little bit of a bit of juice. automatic I think. Yeah. yeah there we go. I don't know. Should I try and walk the notch or go up around it? Uh, that will probably just walk that notch, no problem, with most, the tire size. Most likely. Most likely. All right, be right back. Sounds good to me. Somehow the steepness. Oh, there we go. It's just part of the rock my tire didn't like. Uh, to answer you on that, um, Laura Middleton, uh, I got the, the second gen. Uh, you can get that through Lime's Discord. And the F-250, you're going to be uh, looking into Frog's Discord for info on that. And actually, Frog's literally right here, so we can give you more info on the F-250. Yeah, this is just going to be part of Donator Access once it's finished, so... Sounds good. I wasn't Join the sure... Discord and scroll. <laughs> I wasn't sure them. if it was, like, a like a part of Standard Donator or if it was, like, a, like, Donator, like, plus. Well, but it's not really, like... It, there's just donator and then I have like the Patreon builds. Oh, okay. Yeah, and then I'm working on a 2012 Tundra right now for. Oh, so like a um a second gen. Oh, that's gonna be cool. Uh, yeah, whatever gen it is. <laughs> yeah. Well, third gen would have been 2014 and up. It's like the second body style, not the body style before my body style. Yeah. Yeah, because I put a few models out there for Patreon and, like, had people vote on them and they wanted the Tundra. Hey, that's sick, though. You doing a um, a long travel IFS or are you doing a solid axle? Uh, probably going to be solid axle. Okay. Probably just do it, like, three link. That way it can still be, like, relatively low for, like, a that stock look. I gotcha. Just a bunch of droop in it. That, yeah, that makes sense. That'll be fun. I love how we're kind of taking these very, like, we're going back and forth between trail to trail. We're not really sticking on one trail. <laughs> um, let's oh, see. Hey, you know, the Bentley. rock lines. What's good out there in the chat? I see you checking in. We got Jordan. We got Brian. And let's see, when do I stream? Um, every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday, dude. Um, Monday and Friday from uh, about 12 to 3 EST and Wednesday from 4 to 7 EST. I know we're past, like, 7 EST now, but, like, trying to... Uh, I really actually just wanted to do a little bit of chill trailing here at the end of the stream because I haven't done it in a while. And, you know, like after some massive, you know, sendage, it's nice to relax with some uh, chilled out trailing, especially on a rig right. this, this nice. Oh, yeah, of course. Because it just like the way it looks makes you want to drive it in a it, realistic it, fashion. It, it really does. It really does. Thomas Brown, what's good out there? Oh, for sure. John Shackelford, for sure. Ooh. All right. Got to use a little winch. I'm high centered. Okay. Let me there check. Okay, so we're like actually heading straight there. I didn't realize yeah. we were that high already. Yeah, that's why I took the turns I did. That way we get like the most rock crawling out that's of this climb. Really cool. All right, let me find a. Oh my god. See, I know that this truck can do this, oh. but I'm sorry, sorry. <laughs> I was stuck on a uh, dis uh, d distribution rock. And yeah, I was about to start yanking you to the side, though, because <laughs> of the way I was taking my line. <laughs> yeah, I just needed, like, literally a couple feet uh, to get around that distribution rock. It can climb up the actual rocks just fine, but, like, distribution rocks will stop everything. Doesn't matter what you're in. 
Yeah, nothing likes them. Oh, 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 that was... That was more of a wheel lift than I was comf comfortable with. Sheesh. Full-size invasion. <laughs> hey, I mean, I literally was in, like... I was probably maybe half a foot away from toppling the thing, but... Dude, that one distribution rock came from all the way up here to down there. Yeah. <laughs> it's its own living organism. Literally. Just came to rest in front of you. I love how this thing has so much capability and yet is still challenging. Right. Uh, let's see. Titan Gaming. Um, let's see. Is the Monster Boss on console? Uh, once again, it's not there yet, but it will be a um, little bit later on. Uh, I would check back on that in about, like, I don't know, maybe, like, one, two weeks. I don't know. Uh, however long it takes for Limes to get it all uh, sorted out where he wants it. Mm -hmm. Welcome back, Paige okay. Rogers. I don't think I'm going to be able to make that gap with this without a winch, but that should actually make this gap over here. here maybe I can uh, pull to your back bumper a little bit. Oh, oh. or not. Oh, yeah, I could probably just pull back and get out of here easier. Maybe take up the line a little bit to the left. Yeah. Holy. That was a snap. I don't know if that was lag or just, like, the game. Oh, that was me. I, I let it go. Well, no, 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 no. But, I mean, your truck, like, snapped backwards, like, the physics. Oh. <laughs> yeah, that would be some desinkage. Yeah, there we go. This truck take this line. Yeah, you got that. This thing's not really having any issues through there. I mean, that's just walking the park yeah. for this thing. Oh, geez. Yeah, especially with the 44s on it, it's just going. Except for when I decide to do a board slide. <laughs> Turn you around just a tad bit. All right, we good. Got a nice ding in my door, but... <laughs> oh, my whole front end's messed up. Because when I took and made that bed liner and add-on it totally changed like the entire physics of the truck because of the cdt is oh that's for, weird for the bed was no longer part of the main truck that is so strange but i mean it makes sense it's just it, weird it's just how snow runner sets the center of mass it bases it entirely off the cdt i gotcha so when your cdt is all in the front and in the back is just you know a tiny little piece for the frame like is it when naturally your back is makes nothing it, yeah yeah it naturally makes the back in literally nothing so you have to just adjust it until it feels back the way it was before yeah it's almost there it's just a little bit too not enough weight on the back end yet i got hung up on like a weird uh grip spot back there i don't know what the heck that was but it like i was going around the corner and the physics were just like no and like pulled my truck backwards <laughs> And I wasn't even, my tires weren't really even hitting anything. It was just an odd, like, odd hang-up moment. Yeah, the game likes to have those from time to time. Are you on a winch? Because if not, that is... No, I'm not on a winch. That is nuts. Yeah, I'm just trying to slide it just perfectly. There we go. The Yo! Least. Oh, maybe. Oh, no, there it okay. Is. Come on. Right, oh, I was going to have that. you a little, a little bit here real quick? Come You're on. good. I'm Pull stuck, so sideways. it ain't going to matter. All right, there we go. <laughs> I had to get pulled sideways for that. I need to back down and try that again because I was too far to the uh, to the right. I got completely high centered. All right, I'll stay here in case you need a wind up. Okay. I'm going to need to actually um, recenter the truck entirely because I messed up my positioning. I'm gonna back you up yeah. real quick. Yeah, like... Going down that, that's a gnarly drop off. It's yeah, it near is. impossible to climb up it without scraping your undercarriage. Alright, I'm gonna try I mean, to notch yeah. it. Yeah, if you go on the notch, you should actually be able to not well, damage was, the undercarriage. Well, I was almost there. There we go. I was, I was just a little bit too close to the other side. No, I'm still high center. Wow. Yeah, that's a gnarly climb up. Okay, and finally. Yeah, finally I found the grip, but like, that was a lot more, um, a lot more willing to high center than I thought it was going to be. Um, let's right. see. All right. That sounds good. Truth lies. And, uh, I love his player. Is it right? And I'm going to go ahead and, ow, I'm gonna go ahead and park this guy right on up here. 
and that is where we are going to go ahead and peace out for this stream. Or at least I am going to go ahead and peace out for this stream. But um, yeah, I'll, I'll probably be streaming here later, so go subscribe. <laughs> <laughs> I knew he was going to slide one in. I, I, <laughs> we I might as well, right? <laughs> I was going to say, he ain't that slick. <laughs> Oh, my God. All right, y'all. Thank you guys so much for dropping by today. Thank you so much for hanging out with us and uh, just watching, chilling, hanging out. Whether you were out here watching, chatting, super chatting, or you were one of our moderators or one of the many mod creators that we had out here today, thank you all, like, just each and every one of you for stopping by, no matter what role you uh, you played in the stream today. So, once again, thank you all so much, and, uh, and we will see you all in the next one. Talk to you all later, and I hope you guys enjoyed.